morning comes, I'm feeling dumb, maybe I'm dumb, fuck you, repeat till I'm numb, crazy I love, feels like a drug, yeah, without you's no fun, I'm crazy in love, I'm on a run, trouble sobering up, feeling so fine, I'm so fuck, doing better enough, so I'm rolling up, so I'm rolling up, so I'm rolling up, so I'm rolling up. the back road the last the stories that we told remember the back door the night you kicked me out in the cold now i'm on canaveral remember this time i'm on my own doing better alone soon i'll be gone go do what you want go drink to the sun cause it's always fun until morning comes i'm feeling dumb maybe i'm dumb fuck you repeat till i'm numb crazy i love feels like a drug yeah without you's no fun I'm crazy in love, I'm on a run, trouble sobering up Feeling so fine, I'm so fuck, doing better enough So I'm rolling up, so I'm rolling up 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 Seventeen, all I had was a dollar and a dream. Made a promise to my mama we gon' need it. I will get it together. This shit been hard, but we gon' see. Down for whatever, whenever I give it all up for my team. But I'm still on that same shit. And I recall they said I ain't shit. But I embraced my situation. I stepped up to the plate and played all the cards that I was dealt. Lord took my sister to heaven. Now with some pain I couldn't help. But I can't ever again go back and give in to this shit. I reminisce, I can't forget it all depends. But guess in the end, it just is what it is. I ain't tripping over shit, I gotta get it out. Hey man, I'm speaking so faithfully. Done. You can put your faith in me. I know niggas love to hate the rate that I'm awakening. But I can't help that I was the one chosen when they hate to see. They love to hate on me. But this is how it's made to be, yeah. Yeah. I'm so sorry, I cannot put my pride to the side Sweet me all it won't change my mind I can't forget it all depends, but guess in the end it just is what it is. I ain't tripping over shit, I gotta get it all in. No, I can't ever again go back and give in to this shit. I reminisce, I can't forget it all depends, but guess in the end it just is what it is. I ain't tripping over shit, I gotta get it all in. So do what you wanna do, what you want me to. Yeah. Everywhere I go, it's like playing on pool. The days unfold, no one gonna save your soul. And it's so over the shoulder. Nothing. Pinky friend of a bowler, out of control. Go on and fucking up the team's rock. Did you forget where a team at? Not the side of Jimmy, and I've seen it. Seems so seamless, more like a scene from Machinists. Mean as another three Hurricane Katrina's. The Eva Zane got shit on Jimmy to Christina's. Britney to Whitney to Tina's. A prima donna, why would I wanna treat him? Not the lead singer, a wolf mother, believe him, believe him. He was the reason I'm breathing to me. And everyone should drop to their knees there. I hate Jimmy, I hate Jimmy, I break Jimmy. Oh. Mr. J, oh, rest in peace. Now you never get the best of me. I keep singing that J, oh, rest in peace. Yeah, it's best that I set you free and keep singing that J, oh, rest in peace. I'ma take away the breath you breathe and keep singing that. I made Jimmy, I hate Jimmy, I break Jimmy.
gave your life, you repaid me. Got people playing me with not even knowing what my name is. Look at you with your ladies, look at you trying to play it cool. I know you're full of piss and shallow as a baby's pool. Every jealous fool trying to pull the wool over my eyes. It's destined, always asking a question. Have I got another Jimmy? Got another gimmick? Yeah, I've got another Jimmy and he's death. And it sounds like Jay. You a star now, Mr. to get your bribe round, Hannibal, we your heart out. Mr. to bring the car round, time to meet your makeup.
Dungeons deep and caverns old, we must away a break of day to find our long forgotten gold. The pines were Howdy motherfuckers, Finn boy, Carol, Cain, hello, hello. I got the shaders, guys, can you tell? Hacker menu. Hacker menu, guys. Got my aimbot here. My crosshair. My ESP. My, uh... Super jumps. Gonna go burn down Thieves Landing with hacks. I was not there. She just told me. She said she's wanted for murder. In before some dumb He's prick ready. fucking reports me for that because I have no idea what a fucking shader menu is. I thought I was the mad man. How you doing? What's going on? Hey, ma Master Caddy, there is a uh <laughs> He called me Josie is wanted for murder. Well, it's not Richie Gold. We didn't kill him unless he died of a heart attack right after. I'm not sure who she shot. Master but, Kelly. Master um, Kelly. There was a lot of deputy here looking for her. I sent them to Valentine probably 30 minutes ago. It's about... They will come back soon, I'm sure. But I had to take her to the frontier. She is safe in a camp. But I will have to show you the way. Did she explain? Who the fuck did she... Yeah, what... Okay, let's let's go then. Should we? Yeah, I will take you now? to her. Hi. She is there now. Curious. I need to stop in town and get my warmer coat. I also spent a lot of time in Armadillo today, getting some information and Master some Kelly. things you might be interested in. Well, sounds good. A conversation for another time. What the fuck, guys? Oh, we don't have any water either. I tried to rewatch Game of Thrones last night. I got to episode two, and I'm just like, I can't be bothered, dude. I can't be bothered watching this shit when I know how it ends. Can't be bothered watching that shit. 
when I know that Dumb and Dumber, the twin brothers, the twin dipshits, the conjoined dumbasses, ruin something so fucking bad. Dude, that, that should be a crime. That should be punishable by death. I'm just saying, dude, if you're that dumb, if you're that shit, that you can ruin the best series known to man, objectively, if you can ruin it in three seasons, you need to be put to death. Yeah, I want to. I should. Yeah, that's what I should do instead. Rewatch House of Dragons. That's a good show. for what we did yesterday. How the fuck would- how the fuck would they know she was there? Amazing. Amazing. Uh, amazing. Take your time, game. Take your time. There we go. I can't tell the difference between these shaders, man. Can you guys? What the fuck are you doing, you stupid piece of shit? Can you guys tell the... Can you guys tell the difference? I can't, man. Maybe, maybe when it, maybe when it's daytime. Fucking horses, man. I, mm. But I don't know if I installed the right ones, because he just said shaders, dude. He didn't actually tell me which one it is. There was two presets. I downloaded the one with the most fucking downloads. I, I assume that was his. Maybe he's got the other one. I don't know. I don't know. Why is no one sending us letters, man? Everybody hates Kelly now. Fucking bastard of the north. Ready. I prefer the other code, man. I'm just saying. Just saying. Just saying. I think it's better. And now I'm ready. They were having a meeting at the saloon. And she just walked in, so I knew she was there, but they finished their business. I'm gonna fill up on water before we go up. Base the stream then. I have some still. <laughs> I mean, it looks more blue. Calm down, Tobin. His name. Tobin. What does that mean? It's a name. What does any name mean? Well, that means something. It's a name. 
What is James doing? Uh, Holy King. In the Bible. <laughs> Tobin's from something too, I'm sure. So anyway, there was a Bluestone meeting in which I was there, listening. And, uh, Josie just stumbled in and they saw her. They told her to leave because she is wanted for attempted murder. So she left. She got on a horse. We went to the ranch. Uh, but no one was there, so we flew. We fled up to uh, the frontier to look for the fort, but there was a big fog. We couldn't find where we were going, so instead I took her to a camp. Yeah, it was probably what we did to Richie yesterday. I don't think... He said there's a law party came up. Yeah, there's a lot of them. How many? The one gold. I knew I was here at the time, so they asked me where she went. I sent them towards the other time. Opposite direction. I'm gonna fucking kill this horse, man. What is that, bro? Why do you, why does he go five meters in the air? Why do we have, why is our fucking, why is socks in the NBA, bro? Also, the shaders, they make the game look more like, you think it looks more pixely, guys? It looks more grainy, right? Okay, I think I can tell the difference now that it's daytime. Looks more bright and crisp. Looks more realistic. Can't tell the difference as much as... Give me a minute, though. I, I suppose if we put this next to a, our normal game, you'd probably be able to tell the difference. Am I blind? I am not blind. Master Kelly doesn't get on. You don't gotta call him master. That's what he is. Get a problem with that preacher? No, you know what? Cold, but I'm alright. Would you rather I call him Daimyo? <laughs> Just call him James, you weirdo. Hey, it is not my James culture. Kelly, Northern okay. Warlord. <laughs> feel wrong. That's <laughs> okay, he uh, fills you in. Did you attempt to murder somebody that we don't know about? Not that I'm aware of. Oh, it's so probably... It's yeah, it's probably... It's either gold or, uh, Raul. Raul. Which gold did you shoot? Raul. Well, we didn't shoot him. He got away. Let him get away. Let the fuck is that attempted murder, then? Oh, it must, yeah. not, it must be for Raul, then. Unless he spun them a store. We did make him dig his own grave, though. And he yelled at them that we were trying to kill him. I'm pretty sure you can only get hit with attempted some. murder if you actually cause him some harm. Yeah, well, we'll see. That's partially why I wanted to, uh, to speak with uh, Weller. See what we're, we're facing. Now, hold on, preacher. See what charges we were facing. 
but uh, he turned me around pretty quick, so that I was wanted for attempted murder, had all of loose down there. Apparently, from what uh, Roach is saying, they already had a law, a group of law riding out looking for me. Mm. Yeah, almost as soon as the meeting ended, I went back into town. Um, and they asked me why she went. There was probably four of them. Yeah, I know you don't want to start issue with the law right now, so I just figured it would be best I get out of there. Till we figure out what we're gonna do. Sounds like they're being contracted. You know, we didn't touch a hair on that blonde prick's head. Truth is. Be lying if I said it didn't come close, though, after what he was saying about James. Yeah, whatever, we didn't. Raul, on the other hand... We more likely it's him, right? I don't know. Unless Gold spun a story. Which is likely. Is this normal for Outlaw to tell police on Outlaw? Wouldn't really call him an outlaw. More of a businessman. Mm. Pounds on the person. Is it punishable though? Yes, it is. Frowned upon, yes, so very much. As far as his spin in the story, I highly, well, I would not doubt it whatsoever. He tried to weasel a lot of the fact that apparently he was gloating about shooting James. I heard that from multiple people. I tried to say that wasn't the case. Don't really care at this point. Anyway. I don't care what he says after it. Peter, you got a cigarette. Anyway. Anyway, we're gonna head back to the ranch. As, uh... Anyway, we mid sentence. You fucked. Thank you. I'm sorry. We're gonna get on us from the ranch. He wakes up with the van on. I still ain't got no telegrams from nobody. Because everyone hates you, didn't you hear? Oh yeah, I spent some time in Armadillo today before all of you uh, woke up. I thought I would make myself useful. And uh, I ran into Zip and uh, Isaac Quill, as well as a man named Luca, who said he was gone for very long and he just recently came back. Well, the general opinion is that Preacher is at fault for everything. And uh, Luca specifically said that he ought to be put down. Uh, who's Luca? Luca said, said that. Uh, Luca, yeah. yeah. I only know his first name, but he said he's been gone for a very long time. He has dark skin, very long hair, and uh, a thick mustache, I'm pretty sure. We gotta come and get me. Till then, this rabid dog runs on. That said, to give them the benefit of the doubt, while I was there in that conversation, I said, well, maybe you should consider both sides before you start picking your battles. They don't know the full story, so I implored them to figure it out before they make the moves that they will regret. They seem to agree with me there. You guys prefer the shaders like this? Oops, it made a screenshot. James. Or like this. Without DPX or with DPX? I prefer without, to be honest. Look at that. I like that. Used to live in Dave's land and. We never had enough room for him in Cattleman Gang, so we just used him for odd jobs. I promised him a spot in Kelly Gang when I started, but. And he had to, uh, leave the crossing to find his wife. He helped me out a lot. Fought together a lot. Fairly close. You should talk to him. I 
did implore him to listen to both sides. It might be useful. At the moment, he was just taking Zip and uh, Isaac Quill. Word for it. What the fuck was Zip and what the fuck was Zip and Isaac talking about? They say I should be put down. No, they did not say that specifically. What they say? Uh, well, those two seem kind of undecided about the whole situation, but. Uh, or maybe I shouldn't say this, but my gut was telling me they were leaning uh, on the opposing side rather than in your defense. They did not say anything to defend you, that is for sure. Can this fucking shit get off my fucking screen, man? Yeah, well, they all say different when they talk to me directly. Somebody tell me that to my face, if they got a problem, I'm gonna believe otherwise that they are neutral. I think Zip and Isaac are, at the moment, neutral, but... It seemed like they are simply waiting to pick a side, not sure yet. No, I think they have their hands quite full enough. Uh, perhaps. To be quite clear with the rude boys. Rude boys are riding out right now, all dressed in black. For a funeral, perhaps. Maybe not their own. Yeah, there's Rudy with him. Yes, he wants to speak with you. He said to telegram him when you Oh, oh yeah, okay. So, he, yep. <laughs> Does he forget how to fucking write? What do you mean? I've been writing him each day and go back to him. Alright, well, I'll telegram him. I'll telegram him. Well, clearly, your messages don't go through. Yeah, well, you can telegram him then. Well, I mean, you can if you want. I'm just. I think the postman, he sees it, it's by James Kelly and he eats him up, feeds him to his pony. How do I get this shite off my screen? Somebody ask, give me a minute. There's a left here, right? Holy no. shit. died earlier. I fell down in the glacier. Thank God. What the yeah, I fuck? I was so I was like, uh, you didn't put your name. I didn't know if it was somebody trying to... Uh, what the fuck do I do here, man? Bait me to come up here? Yeah, but I figured I'd just go check. Well, good. I'm glad I didn't have to go fucking looking for you guys. You still want to go to Van Horn? Me? Oh, James. Yeah. Have medical bags. Oh, no, yeah, Rochi, never, never Rochi follow well. James. Never follow James. <laughs> yeah, I got, I got. Uh, oh no, I don't have a bag. James, do you have a bag? No, I don't. All just follow him off the fucking Well, when answering the age-old adage, the truth has been found. <laughs> they would follow him off the cliff. He is my master. I must. <laughs> Um, what do you hear? Yeah, just leave me here to die in the cold. Uh, I'll, get, I'll, I'll walk back with ice. You know, I'll have my horse fire. I'll just come down with an egg. I'm gonna leave you here, you're gonna die of frostbite. So I'm tired of walking down with these fucking popsicles. Bro.
Can I get this shit off my fucking screen for the love of God, cunt? Bro, what the fuck is that, man? What the fuck is that? What is that? Yeah, amazing game design, you stupid rock star fuck. Let's put fucking fog where you can't see shit right before a fucking cliff, you smart fucking... God, you're so smart. You're so smart. Can't design clothes, can't design maps. What can you design? How about you design a fucking... Mmm. Gotta say something. I'm not gonna say it. It was not me. Why would they... What the fuck? Why put a fucking f fog that you can't see through? Yeah, yeah, I wouldn't run off a cliff if I could fucking see the cliff, you smart ass. Go fuck yourself. Go fuck yourself. Biased and dumb. Biased and stupid. That's what you are. Biased and stupid. You are brainless. Your brain is the size of a pea. It's got the texture of a slug. You're a smooth brain fucking Neanderthal dumb cunt. You have a tiny, tiny, tiny brain. I'm so infuriated, I've, I've got a headache. I just got so mad, my head started hurting. What is that shit? What is that shit? It was like a two foot drop and we died. What is that? Ooh. And we're stuck on a rock. Help. Master yep. Look, look at what we fell down. Look at what we fell down, guys. That's what we fell down and and got knocked unconscious. Look at that. Look at that tiny little drop. Two foot drop. Not even. What is that shit? This is not the warrior's death I was hoping for. <laughs> if 
Oh, bro. Just fucking get me out of here. Can we fucking RP? Can we just roleplay? Can we go fucking do something? Why the fuck? I'm blaming them. I'm blaming them for going to the frontier. Their fault. It's their fault. And if it isn't their fault, it's Rockstar's fault. And if it isn't Rockstar's fault, it's still their fault for making stupid physics. What kind of physics is it? What kind of- what is this shit? Yes, horse jumps 20 meters into air. Okay, next time. Horse falls down, one foot drop, and you die. Amazing. Fantastic. Are these horses just fucking stupid? Like, what the fuck? Do they know horses are fucking smart? Horses don't do that. Horses don't drop fucking- horses don't fall. Okay, they know there's a there's a drop coming. They're they're omnipresent. They're they've got they're smart animals. What is this shit? What the fuck is that? Tell me, what is that shit? Fucking shitty rock star. Fucking shit. Piece piece of shit company. Terrible. Fuck them. Only way James never falls if he lives in open. Help! <laughs> Where are they? I am trying, but I cannot get up. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, fuck this shit. Fuck this shit. Fuck this shit. Sunny stream today, guys. Sunny stream. Fuck this shit. Hey! Hey! We're in the river! Help. Somebody. We're in the river! Hey! Please. You must save faster, Kelly. <laughs> I, heard, I heard them whispering, bro. Who is it? Where's Tibbet when we need her? Fuck the frontier. Fuck Rockstar and their shitty physics, their shitty mechanics. Piece of shit. Fucking shit company. Fuck them. Get me out of here. What the Look at that. One foot drop. One, literally one foot. Literally, I don't know how many feet that is. Two feet. One feet. One foot. Two foot. What the fuck is that shit? Fucking shitty, stupid horse. Slug-brained idiot horse. But it's not the horse's fault. The horse is a pixel. Rockstar created that pixel. Their fault. Always their fault. Oh. 
the preacher's already probably walked past us by now, dude. And they'll never see us because, oh, look at this. There's just, you know, just fucking... There's, there's a snowstorm conveniently yeah. right here. That never goes away. Convenient fucking snowstorm right where there's a ledge. Hmm. What a fantastic idea. What a great idea. Let's put this snowstorm here right where this ledge is. Just so someone can fall off it. Isn't that a fantastic idea? Yes, let's do that. That'll add so much to our game. Amazing. Amazing. Amazing game design. I love when people add shit in their games just to annoy people. It's fantastic. Such a good idea. Help! Help! <laughs> Fence crossing sheriff's department. We're in the river. We're in the river. Where are you? In the river. Help! In the How river. The fuck did you I am here to. I'll get you. I'll get you. I'm saving the master first. Yeah, save the master. <sighs> Hallelujah. I'm glad you are showing your respect now. Calling in master. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Good job, socks. Good job. Ugh. Shit. What the hell? You need to put us on rocks. You need to put you on rocks? Mm hmm You can't do it on the snow. Oh my lord. Oh. Josie was saying she hates this place. I love it. But I, I said, am. if this is hell for us, at least now, uh, imagine our foes when they come up here, and we know this mm -hmm. land better for them. Yeah, exactly. It'll be a foreign and windy hell to them, and they'll be scraped against its shore. Fuck happened. I don't want to talk I about it, dude. We're safe out. now. We don't have to worry about it. Way. If I keep thinking about it, if I talk about it one more time, my head's gonna start hurting again. Because I got so angry that I got a headache. So now I gotta calm myself down. Get rid of said headache. Shut up, toilet. Shut up, toilet. Toilet. Quiet. Now why I'm down here, I should tell you. The. The Bluestone Security Company. They carry $500 on them while they transport goods for robbers. So that they do not take the cargo, but instead take the money. Huh. What if the robbers take both? That's what I was thinking. <laughs> Something to note, though. to avoid violence and see what they're doing. What if they take both? <laughs> yeah, I actually didn't think of that. When I was thinking, I'm like, hmm, that's, that sounds nice. That's a free 500 bucks. I didn't even think of taking both. <laughs> Uh, I'm so stupid. We will adapt. Eventually. Mm. I also heard down there that a woman named Jackie was going to fall in with uh, Hathaway. And right. uh, it sounds like one of Jesse Gold's friends or something was riding with them on a job. <laughs> I don't give a fuck about their love triangle. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> hey, our, sh our shit went away, guys. Thank you. 
Yeah. Look at shit. Medical bag. Oh my god, but DPX is installed again. What do I have to do? I have to change something in the Should path or something? If you can get him. That's fucking stupid and dumb. Well, let's take him to town. Just put on my horse. It'll be easier. You take his horse. Okay. See you in town. Oh, I'm gonna wait for you so you don't crash. Where is this shit? The horse? You see him right there? It is very oh, you're... foggy. Fuck, hold on. You stay here. You stay here. I'm gonna get it. Bring it to you. Mm, get right on the fucking frontier immediately. Be good. 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 You see him? He's right here. Yeah. All right. Okay. Oh. oh, Lordy Lord. Oh, you fucking horse. Be careful. Oh. He didn't make it down the mountain. I would have guessed that one. We will, we will. Thank God. Oh. We will learn this land. Back to town. We will learn it. It'll be time, but we will. <laughs> Very hard to learn the land when there's a fucking snowstorm and you can't see your fucking pecker in front of you. Well, that's why I need to know it without even seeing it. Trial by error. I you need to be as, as blind as the bat, right but as smart as the bat, too. But it, it is why you they, have put, chances. they put those lanterns there so you can see through the fog. If you follow them onto that side, you will get down. Well, I walk through the shadow of the valley of death, such as, such as this one. I fear no evil. For the Lord is with me. And his lights as well. And the other senses he gave us to navigate this place. Hey, can you guys send a telegram to Rudy? Yeah, yeah. Somebody get him up. You got a bag? Yeah. All right. Wheel it. Toilet. You know, it might not even be all, Toilet, these, boy. Uh, all these wars that kill us. It might just fucking be this place. The one slip off a cliff, we're all done for. I hate, I hate minutes emotes, bro. <laughs> what is that shit? What is that shit? It's worse than yours. Worse than your Grinch. My favorite emote. Is he gonna make it? Nope. He's dead. Spread word out. Horse finally did it. James Kelly is fallen. Yeah, that one's good too. Meme trick. He's fallen down the mountain. Ay 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 ay. Last words were. Has this hairline always looked like that? What the fuck, guys? It's, it's uh, 
What's wrong, what's wrong with my hairline? No, nothing. Oh, it's it's like fine. Pretty soon. It looks fine. What do you mean? I catch a damn break. <laughs> Uh, Where'd he send it from? Send word if he's free. Can't what? Apparently, Dechenzo's were gearing up for war. Oh. Uh, Already bent the knee. Against who? Del Lobos. Who bent the knee? Dechenzo's. They, they bent the knee to Del Lobos? Mm hmm. What do you mean? Like they made peace? They're under them? Uh, Apparently, yeah. DC still around? Yeah, the most of them went to no pixel. Some of them are still around, I think. I, I ain't seen them. The the Tark's going hard though. That's good to see. Happy for him. Going hard over there. In the shitter's den. But you know what? He's successful. They're good on him. Good on him. Well, the thing is about the Dicenzos is I don't know. They're businessmen, aren't they? Primarily. Sure. So if a conflict doesn't aid their business, why would they fight it? These are the Lobos. Sounds like a spat. I don't know why we put this back on if we're going out to the east. This one's way too long and warm. I wish I could fucking turn off, what is it? DPX. Without it making my game fucking throw, show that error message. I'm gonna have to go into the files or some shit. If you're getting this man indecisive when it comes to clothes. No, I just like... You know, if we're gonna wear this to signify that... We're from the north. If we're gonna wear clothes like that... Wear the shorter one, so it makes it more realistic. If we're gonna go to the east, where it's relatively warm. You looking for someone injured? Yeah, two people injured up here. Yeah, that was me. I'm all good I think, now. Well, yeah, we got him. Uh, okay. Apologies, sir. Was there so. another pal? <laughs> everyone's oh, everyone's, everyone's all right now. Far. They should be. Yep. Lovely. So I'm just glad you said I was safe. Appreciate yeah. it. No worries. Thank you. Um, what music are we playing? James, where's that one? That ad. Somebody's gonna end up on their ass. Because they can't see shit. I got uh, two medical bags now, just in case. Yeah, I got one. We can go to just 
this way. You're going down this way. Yeah, I meant go to the right to avoid the river, you dumbass, and then go down, obviously. We're gonna have to cross the river again, it goes all the way down. Yeah, sure, sure, sure. Drop it. I'll listen. What is going on today with these fucking freezies, McFreezies? I get we're in the snow, guys, but my computer is getting frozen. What's this? Jerry Gunter and the sounds of the century. This song is ass. No, it's all right. Each day has its memory. Each night has its dream. Each hour is a life. Doesn't suit the snow, but I like it. Okay, yeah, I like this. to enjoy Uh, oh, uh, don't worry about that. That was us. We're fine now. Uh, sorry, uh, really clear now. I said, don't worry about that. That was us. We're fine now. Uh, to reports uh, in the uh, frontier, from Colter. Uh, uh, did you did you end up finding the the two individuals? That there? was us. Oh, wonderful. Okay, I, I I greatly appreciate that. There, I'll definitely update the paperwork. Got no problem. Take it easy. What? What? Much obliged, there, gentlemen. Take care. Is I a little bit quiet there, or is he, is he is playing up? Yeah, I heard you fine. <laughs> what a nice night it is. Uh huh. Oh, I like this song. 
I'm gonna add it to the playlist. Do we expect the fight? The shaders look shit if I can't turn off DPX, man. Like, it looks so much better without DPX on. But when I turn DPX off, it says that I can't, like, change the files and the error message comes up on the screen. So I need to find a way to fix that. Oh, I need to check telegrams quickly. Oh, Josie's wanted, I forgot. Wait on the outskirts since Josie's wanted. I'll be quick. <laughs> Just fucking ice, man. Just ice. Sweet. Sweet this way. Could go around, yeah, apparently. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. <laughs> I can't fix it, smartass. You saying shit, don't do nothing. I know. I know. I know, meme trick. I know. Trust me, you think I don't- I'm not looking at my screen? Sometimes it's good, sometimes it's bad. We all know this. We all know this. This is common knowledge. Look, see, now it's relatively fine. Okay? Why is it fucked? I don't know, my computer's old. Fucking cinematic camera. What was that, dude? Why did it try and do a U-turn? <laughs> Why did it try and do a U-turn? This looks really nice with the shaders, actually. This looks really nice. Looks like a painting.
Look at the sunrise with the shaders, guys. Look at that. The deer on the horizon. Look at that. Have a look at that. Or to shoot him in the head for that. <laughs> Being antisocial. <laughs> yeah, that's a very good reason. <laughs> Need your fucking playlist. I don't have a playlist. Do you know what my playlist is? I boot up YouTube and I look at my recommended. <laughs> yeah, we're heading to Van Orn. Look at that. Look at the... Look at that. It looks like we're going to heaven. Looks like the stairway to heaven. Looks like morning, morning fog, you know? I love morning fog. I got a subscription to Spotify. YouTube's just better. Yeah, I mean, YouTube's just as good, man. If not better. Just their, rec their recommendations, their... Whatever it's called, their algorithm. is so much better. Why do they fucking stop in front of us? Oh, these shaders even look make Van Horn look good. The shaders make Van Horn, Van Horn look good. Howdy. Howdy. You know, I'm about to... Yeah, oh, well, look at this. Little James Kelly comes for an old visit. Welcome, welcome. Get yourself a drink. <laughs> Be right out with you. I love Smokey. I love Smokey. I look at that old James Kelly gun get a drink. I'm going to hang with you. Ha, ha, ha. Ah, God loves Smokey. Nah, 
I come again to the name of the old name Kelly. Can I come get a drink? I'll be in there with you. Damn, five on the diesel. Can I brush my fucking horse? Thanks. Thanks. What the fuck is Everett here, guys? What the fuck? What is this? That's so awkward. Cinnamon churros. Oh my god. Get one, all right. Grab the stew. That's good, that's good. Y'all need to be uh, hungry for the line of work. Shaders, um, am I using just reshade? How is the line of work these days? Say, Josie. I said you might want to stretch out your legs a little bit. Mr. Kelly. Hey, Bella. Yeah. yeah. It is. You want to have a word? Yeah, he told me to uh, send you a telegram and we got settled in. I've sent you about fucking 50 of the fuckers. Yeah, well, I've had a lot on my fucking play. Come, come for a walk. Let's go. Yeah, you got a lot on your play right now. You got some, uh, you got some refugees up here. Refugees? What do you mean? Uh, have you, uh, gone and checked in on Mills? You awake? No, he's still in bed. Yeah, then no, no point. <laughs> oh, fair enough. Just thought you might want to see if he's alright. What can I do for you? You want to know? Or this trade thing. Yeah, maybe. I think Reacher over there wanted to talk to you too. I don't know why he's staying over there. Hmm. What does he want? Uh, I don't know. He hasn't told me what he wants. Hmm. Alright. Well, the fucking war, we just had a bit of a situation in Saint Denis with them. They're out in numbers today, so be careful if you're wanted. I might be, I got no clue. But uh I had a talk with preacher after hours. And uh we left some things out of our chat. Alright. Apparently, Preacher was strung up like an animal and carved. Sliced. Mm. Right. More like an animal, more like Samson, I think he said. Something to do with the Bible. Not something I wanted to do. Or something I desired to do. But you can't be going around calling someone a fucking snitch. When they're not. He had a chance to. Do something if he wanted. He chose not to. He decided to run his mouth instead. I let him go once. I gave him a warning once. 
What would you have me do, James? If you warned a fella and they continued doing what be done, what do you do? I probably wouldn't have warned him. If I was around, I doubt right. that would have happened. Right. Well, I knew that he was friends with folk out west, and I have good relations with those folk, so I gave him a pass. He's lucky to be alive, really. I ask you this straight up, James. No bullshitting, no games or such. Is this gonna be a fucking problem? Because I have enough on my plate, as I'm sure you do too, that we do not have to have a squabble over something that I think is done and dusted. He put my name out there. He tarnished my name. I received payment for that. As far as I'm concerned, sleeping dogs may lie. Doesn't have to come to any unnecessary violence among us and dozens of people hurt. Yeah, I agree. Got a fair bit on my plate now, too. Hmm. Yeah. Did you hear what happened to Mills? Who did that? Yeah. Preacher found him in Armadillo after. Now you want to talk about people talking to law. It's starting to look like maybe they did. They Wouldn't tried doubt to send it. law down here to Van Horn to try to apprehend him. Which would have caused me fucking problems. So I might have a gold problem myself. Our uh, interests may align. Are you currently at odds with the golds? I was at odds with the golds before what happened to Mills. I just stoked the fire a little bit. Mm. Well, if our interests are aligned, we have the same enemy. The enemy of my enemy is my friend, no? I will talk to Breacher if he wants a little chit-chat. But after what he pulled with Jack Kettleman, I would ask that both of us are unarmed for this chit-chat. We do things in words. Getting a bit old there, what will be? <laughs> we all get older. Thought you were a quick draw. Don't think you can outgun preacher. I've <laughs> never been a quick draw. <laughs> you sure? That's where I used to hear stories. Hmm. I only believe half of what you hear and all that such, right? I'm gonna talk to him, I'll see if he wants to, uh... You're a quick drawer, so is Mills. I know you're fast, James Kelly. I know you have a gun on you. I know you're a killer. I respect that. You know what you are. And you embrace it. No, I'm no quick draw artist. But I will stand my ground when he accused me of debaucheries, of terrible deeds, 
Because in our world, there is nothing worse than that. It's like calling someone in his world a worshipper of the devil. Could not stand. I'll go talk to him. He don't want me present. I will talk to him if he wants a little talk. But if it's more than that, James, I'd like to know. I don't like surprises. Why well, ain't a liar. We're discussing the chances. If we were go to go to blows after he told me this, I was upset. Mm. But like you said, it's done. When you put it that way, I would have done the same thing, if not worse. He has caused enough trouble, James. You have your problems, I have mine. And some of those problems are shared. We could help one another. You gonna put your guns down? Because if I go take his, uh, only fair. Yeah, I'll put my guns down too. Could be right. me and you, him and one of mine. He has a, you know, you take his guns, my fella takes mine. We go talk it out at the lighthouse. We smooth this all over, put it to bed. Um, I'll go talk right. to my fucking on me up there. Yep. Bring Eddie, I'm starting to like him these days. <laughs> yeah, he has become a little more likable as he's aged, I agree. Oh, pain in my ass for all. From, apart from getting that fucking witch. The fucking help Mills. <laughs> yeah. yeah, he has a certain way of doing things. Uh, well, he wants to uh, talk in the lighthouse, me, you, and two, and one of his guys as well. But he wants, uh, he wants both of you to be unarmed. Is he gonna be unarmed? Yeah, the only armed people will be me and the other guy. Wait, so how many people you need? Just preacher? Yep. Yeah. The only people unarmed will be, or armed will be you and who? Whoever he brings, I think Eddie. But the both of us will be on arms. So you want my guns? Yep. Wait till we get up there. The right house, you say? Yeah, just up there. Okay. If we hear, if we hear shooting, I'm fucking lighting up this whole town. Hi. Uh, Maybe just the ones he's speaking with right now. Yeah, maybe not them. The whole time. Hello. How you doing, Zip? How you doing? I'm around. Did you guys got Raul? Yeah, we did. The golds. Uh, came to. Armadillo. I saw one of them this morning and one of them last night. Yeah, we saw them too. Made Richie dig a grave. When Locke came, of course. I heard. Well, uh, served its purpose. Yeah. These are my intentions. James, Eddie's not around, so I'm bringing him out. Rumble. Yeah. We're back out in a second. Luca's back.
So I would disarm. Apollo, dude. Killed the pirate up here once. You what? Killed the pirate up here once. Long story. Oh, lovely. <laughs> In the interest of fairness, you can take my weapons, James. And Mac can take his. Yeah. Guns do you have? Yeah, I know. I, I apologize. You can have, have. You never can have too many guns, right? Jesus Christ! Uh... All right. Reach on. Good day. How are you doing? Well, my wounds have healed. Hmm. God, it's still seems. with me, I suppose. Yeah, it seems he has you for another purpose. You have more to do. I think so. Heard you wanted a talk. I guess this is about breaking bread. So I will start by saying that what you did was wrong. The word that you spread, your indecision on it, this rumor can do the damage of truth. So I warned you once, I let you go. What happened to you was because you continue to speak it. This falsehood that is more insulting to me than you'll ever know. I hate to Bullock. disappoint you, but this conversation mm. can hardly be had till Mills is well and out of here. No, this is between you and I. This has always been about you and I. Not Mills, not Jack, not James. Me and you. Well, the actions of both of us drag many through. And whose fault is that? God fucking damn it. Jesus Christ, bro. Beam speak. Beam speak. No confession. No evidence. What the fuck? The other one to a duel. Ah. What can I? The word they said. The victor would be vindicated by God, the loser, therefore I guilty. And if he survived the ordeal of the duel or surrendered, he'd be hung until death. Very insightful. Long as man put aside logic and reason in the layaway to choose the old way to do things. And at first I shunned it, I thought it was mad. The longer I thought on it after that day, I grew to it. You had your opportunity, Preacher. You had your moment. 
you were at the crossroad you had a decision to make you chose your path I would have had that opportunity again if I'd not been stabbed by her if I'd not been shot down by the people no you would not have if you had come to me again preach I would have gunned you fucking down no questions asked you had your shot you had your opportunity to put your money where your mouth was to draw iron on me if you felt it was so strong in you your little theory who makes you god here who makes you get to decide when is the right opportunity and when isn't tell me I Wallaby. Do. i do you because what because why and what gives you the right to come to me and accuse me of such debauchery because Big L, the big bad warden who killed half the fucking West looking for skulls of fellas from the West told you something and didn't even charge you for it. You are a fool. You were bamboozled by a madman. A madman that is now dead. Oh, I have given my fucking word and you. I have bled long enough but they sure in this fucking game. I have bled long enough in this game i have done too much to be accused of something so vile by the likes of big fucking l and i haven't bled neither i'm just a skinned baby what am i i'm early 30s now i've bled too i've been in this game have you yeah and i know the consequences it carries mm, shooting jack kettleman in thieves running around calling me a snitch and if you're playing this game you're playing it very fucking poorly he weighed me down with all this fucking money i mean he's all yeah, his he guns from what i said <laughs> no i speak <laughs> truth i, I saw you when i walked out of sissica in annisburg See, I didn't, the first I didn't thing go i told around you wall the snitch wallaby's a snitch screaming i said <laughs> wallaby i want to know about him See, like, what's his history I got told about your history a bit. Hmm. And what you learn, Prejo? Well enough to have suspicions. <sighs> Unfucking believable. But I don't care about that no more. Right. What is it that you do care about, Prejo? You taking me in that basement, tying me against the pole after I'd been shot. That was your doing. That was your doing. Masked man. That was your doing, my friend. It was your boys all the you time. You can, but it makes man. you get out of it. When I saw you in those fields, I could have gunned you down then and there. You know this. Then you should have, and maybe I should have gunned you down there and there, but we didn't. We no, I let you on. go. I let you go because I didn't want to hurt you. I didn't want your blood. I had no interest in it. So I made it very clear. We deal with it now, or we let it fucking go. And I told you that. Did Only I not? I take mercy from us, the Lord, so don't bother giving me to get on out of that. You see, I see the bigger picture here. We are at precipice of something deadly. No, we were fools fighting a fool's war fighting law. That's what we were. And what of it? Now we are to fight one another. It's what they always done. It's what man has always us. done. It frustrates me. You poked the lion twice. The lion bit back and now you're mad. You know, if I have someone go up to James Kelly and call him a fucking snitch to his face and that person gets gunned down, I don't blame James Kelly one fucking bit. He's got a point, bro. He's got a You're point, man. Guy. No. It's logical. It makes sense. I don't do things for no fucking reason. I do not do things under emotion. Even when you got carved up, I wasn't mad at you. That was a message beyond you. 
People in the crossing needed to hear, people out west. If I had let you go a second time, I would have looked weak. And what about the way you slagged my name? Things I heard. I what? Slag my name. Where you drag so? it through the mud. How so? Were you going around saying I'm calling you a snitch, yelling at me? Truth was, I was asking about it. But never once did I outright say Wallaby's a snitch. I know this. Never once. I don't know who talked to you, who told you stories, but they told you wrong. Fella, your own people shot you down. That wasn't my doing. Know what it was when you picked me up afterwards. Took me down did, there in that What pole. did you expect? Who was that man? Oh, why am I asking? You'll never tell me. He said he was part of my past. <laughs> Here's where I stand. I'm going to put my cards on the table. I have no interest in any more bloodshed with fellow outlaws. I have bigger concerns. As do you, so does James. Now, me and you, we can go back and forth. We can do the blood for blood game and we can continue shedding it until we're all fucking dead. Or we can let sleeping dogs lie. We can move on and worry about the real fucking problem. And that's the law and not just them, people helping them. Namely, the Golds. Yeah, the Golds. Those states yes, are perfect. They... They did bad it down in Thieves. Was. And they did bad here. They shot down my... good friend Mills. But worse than that... is they went and told the law. They told the law... down there in Van Horn is a wounded Mills. They mm. tried to bring the law to my doors. Well, I there, thought we'd seen Armadillo yesterday. Point being, they're my fucking concern right now, not you. Well, they ain't as much as concern as you think. As I said, I saw him in Van Horn, and I made him dig his own grave. Law showed up, took him away, he practically crawled up Willie's pant leg. Mm -hmm. I saw him. Point being, I don't have a concern or desire to go back and forth with you, Preacher. What I did was for what you said, and whether you told ten people or one, it's not the fucking point. I told you that day. You do something now, or you keep your fucking mouth shut and you move the fuck on. I warned you that. You did not heed that warning, and what happened, happened. If you cannot live with that, that's not my fucking concern. But the gold dark. Everything else is concerned, but I'm not, I'm just nothing. I didn't say you're nothing. I'm meeting you here to move things over, put this to fucking bed. Before it gets out of hand where it shouldn't go. I'm smoothing over where he's besides calling me an idiot. There ain't no fault in the matter. Still don't. Tell me what my fault is, Preach. I do tell. You heard wrong. You acted wrong upon it. Did you tell a single person this fucking lie? Did I tell a single person that you... you Did you a tell snitch? a single fucking person uh, lie? I never said you were a snitch. I asked about you. Then why I did Jack Kettleman shoot you down? Why did you Mills want to fucking shoot you down? You tell me. I'll tell you why. Because hmm. I didn't shoot you down on those planes. That's my dad shot. Mills wanted to shoot me. 
his eye and fall with peaches over a grave site. Now, why I was Jack Kettleman mad you didn't shoot me in the field? Well, because I was indecisive. Right. Said, right. Right. It was a lesson. But I think indecision sometimes gives more and uh, more time to think. Oh, for fuck's sake. There was no thinking. It was my word or big L's. The end. Stop. Fucking stop. Use your fucking brain. <sighs> Take the motherfucking game out of Van Horn. How the fuck do I get him down a ladder? <laughs> Say where I'm gonna get Matt down. Fuck. Yeah. Jesus Christ. No. Calm everyone down. No one do anything fucking crazy. You're gonna have to catch him. Alright. Alright, you ready? Catch him. Yep. Alright, let me get him down. Jesus fucking Christ. Go ahead. Fellas are starting to. Oh, it's gummy. Drop him. Ah! Right, get him out of Van Horn. Is this Fuck me. Make sure you give his guns back. Trade him with, uh... Trade him with, uh, James. For mine. Oh, no, Matt's... Never mind. <laughs> Fuck. I'll give you your things back. I mean, just kick him in the face a lot. Now, I know your business isn't my business, James, but that one fucking loose as soon as possible. But again... Not my fucking business. Um. Fuck, which telegram was yours? Oh no, just throw it out, it's probably useless. Yeah, have a cigar. You wanna wait for his guns or no? Uh yeah, if you don't wait. Jesus Christ. I hey. see that went well. Yeah, you know, I told him either move the fuck on or not. And he decided to try and draw blood yet again. I was glad no one was shot. Good call yeah. on no guns. Yeah. <laughs> Turns out. I mean, you're right. 
I'm gonna let this go. When you do whatever you gotta do with in house, not my fucking Hope business. But do not bring that fella to Van Horn again. Daily can help you. Yes, you can take a look at my face. <laughs> We got Eddie around. I haven't seen him. Good question. Oh, I haven't seen him at all. Stop looking with your fucking mouth full. It's rude. I got it from Goldie. Or Goldie got it from me. <sighs> Get up, man. Give uh, James the fella's guns back. Give him the, give him the, Josie, I ain't got the pocket space. No rats. You know why ever it's here? <sighs> Looking at the mills, I would assume. Favreau's refused to leave is what he says. Wants to be here for Mills. Yeah, she wants to be. Yeah. Huh. Mills is hidden down below safely. Now, if it? you could, if anyone asks you where Mills is, the story we're telling is that he was taken back out west so Lord had come here looking for him, alright? If anyone asks. Yeah, I'll do that. And James. I appreciate you not shooting me. I know you could have. There go. For your bass, man. No needless violence for your bass. For your bass. For your bass. Guys, it's for your best. Hey, did any of you send somebody out to a doctor? No, not me. Apparently, somebody rode through here on a Turkoman with somebody on the back of their horse unconscious, and I can't find Eddie. Well, it be Where's the preacher? And where is the preacher? I don't know. They might have taken him up to the house. Stretch your legs. Oh, man, it needs to be looked over. Yeah. Did you fellas see where uh, they took the preacher? Oh, he got pushed. Oh, well, people right towards Sentinel. This is all we saw. Uh, your, <laughs> which one of your people had him? Nice. Oh, Alright, well. Then away we the taken him. Why the fuck were they taking the Sentinel? Well, the fellow was on Wait, which. Where? Did he have a white horse by chance, pink, almost pink? Yeah, like a, a yeah, yeah. turn. Yeah, yeah. alright, no, that's him. Where's my fucking horse?
You got the right preacher. Yeah. I do a telegram station. What happened, James? Did you get him? No, I didn't get him. He was unarmed. Fuck him, I was unarmed when he stabbed me. He didn't stab you. Yeah, this blackies do it. Fuck that fella too, though. He's going to kill me as well. So I had a conversation. Did that conversation go? Took out the armed one. <laughs> oh, he could have ended it there. <laughs> I would have been a shit show preacher on the ground. This way, this way. You give preacher his weapons. Look at these shaders, man. Amazing. Beautiful. Yeah, we could have shot Wallaby there, but I didn't want to. It didn't feel right. I think Wallaby thought we were going to shoot him, so he tried to choke us out. <laughs> he tried to choke us. Uh, then Killy, that was, that was a shit show, man. Killy kicked him off Preacher. <laughs> but it was too late. Good RP move, no shooting. Yeah, I mean, what was the point of shooting there? What was the point of shooting? There would have been none. He had no guns, the other guy was already downed, I mean, you know, there was no point. Didn't need to happen. Pick your telegrams, break your safe, ready to go back to you. Let me get my guns. If I could. Rudy! No, he didn't. He didn't get back to me. What the fuck? DF337 MB240 Ellie Respond to your fucking telegrams Dude, I got the itch to play Sunny, man, but we got shit to do on Kelly. We really don't, to be honest. But what did he say to you? In a group. Hey, Wallaby. Yeah. That he doesn't want anything to come from it. Something like that. To be honest with you, Preacher, I think this is real pointless. It's always up to you at the end. I said if you want to tell me to stop, I will. But James, they tied me to a pole in the basement and cut me up. You don't know the truth, Preacher, if anyone... 
accused me of that, it would have been a lot worse. Bunt, we still got your back. I ain't picking sides here, I'm just saying. A complicated situation. He sure is, but he speaks it different from the way it was. As if I went around ringing a bell with his name on it. James, you gotta, you gotta decide, because if it is up to me, I'm gonna continue this. Unless you tell me not to. I told you what your best told me, right? I did. Correct me if I'm wrong, anyone, but to me, this feels like needless violence. You're not balanced. Then ain't the bastards, too? Ain't it all? Raul is pretty needless, the goals are pretty needless, all this is pretty fucking needless. We could just leave it. I agree with you, Raul was needless, but I wasn't the one to shoot him. That was you. But what about all the bastards? About the golds. I'm sure, they shot you. Same way Walby stabbed me. I'm sure they got their reason. Same way Walby got his. That old needless, because we all got bigger fish to fry. We've always had bigger fish to fry. It's never been different. I say a preacher's hell bound getting his blood, I say he gets his blood. Stance. The bastards ain't needless because I did that to defend you. I don't need to go further. If you wanted to, as Bill, I will go to hell with you to do so. But you're not going to convince me on this, so if you want me not to do it, you just need to say no. If I'm being honest, Rachel, the fact that you feel you need someone to hold your pain and guide you on this is a little bit on its own. I, I feel I respect Jones James, sure. but James has saved my life. And I would not be here if not for him. And if he doesn't want this war, and he says no to it, then I will not chase it. I think I'm well founded in letting him make the decision here. And if there'll be bloodshed. Because he knows where I stand. But ultimately this is his outfit. The gang is torn, man. We got... We got Orochi here calling Kelly Master. Daimyo, Northern Warlord, his supreme leader. We got Preacher here with undying loyalty to Kelly because he saved his life. Then we got Ice and Josie. Man, make up your own mind. Fuck what Kelly says. <laughs> Preacher. I love it. Yeah. May I ask you a question? Yeah, go ahead. Do you feel that? What happened to you? Made you lose even a little bit of honor? Did they dishonor you? I'd say tying a fellow up to a pole, beating them, torturing them, slicing them is pretty dishonorable. But then in my opinion, I know it doesn't mean much yet, but then they should die for that. Oh my god, He's dude. Delayed. You can't argue with any anything anybody is saying, dude. Everybody's right, man. Everybody's right. I wish Wallaby didn't fucking torture him and make him this make him so make this so hard, dude. Jesus Christ, this is so hard. 
I really don't want to do it, dude. I know Kelly would do it, dude, but yeah, I, don't I don't want to do it. I don't like that at all. But I don't think uh, now, nah, but I don't think Kelly would do it, dude. After after Jabas, man, I don't think he would. I don't think he would. And it's gonna not sit right with you. The only reason you wouldn't do it is because somebody told you not to. I don't like that at all. If you're gonna do something, do it. Yeah, but I. It should be pain. Nah, I don't think a war would. Unknown Wallaby for a long time. He's crossed me a lot. He'll do it again. But right now, it don't feel justifiable. Did they not dishonor your brother? That's fine then, but when he does cross you again, because I know he will when he stabs you, you damn well better have me by your side. And I'm taking his head. Bridget, if I was going to abandon you, I would have dropped you after fucking J after you did what you did to Jack. Told you I ain't leaving. Not again. I'm just saying let's buy our time, do, do what we have to do with the bastards and the golds and the rest of the Muppets out west. Let's do some purging. Right. And there will be a time when Wallaby does something. He is not a simple man. Very complex. He'll do something. At least I fucked that other craven up. Right now ain't the time. Yeah, I'll agree with James on that one. I don't think a war with whatever fucking Van Horn is right now would uh, be in our best interest. All right, then that's all I need to hear. I won't pursue it further until the time comes. Where are we headed? I got no fucking clue. I'm yeah. just enjoying the scenery. Why not out west? We got prospecting to do. Joel. You see Law had a family back? And around them, at West. What, Josie? Actually, Run. I want to have a chat with the Del Lobos if they're around. Figure out what they're talking about the golds. I know you're all we're all buddy buddy with uh, what's his name again. Sam, Samwell. Yeah, Santiago. That's right, him. But he's the scum I'm talking about, polluting the West. No one believed me when I said it about the golds, and now look. We're fine. Whatever you want to do with them, I'm with you. You'd know what I'm talking about if you were there in that saloon when I was surrounded by 20 of them. Things I was saying. Insane. Ever gone to a comedic play? No, I've never been to any play. Me either, but that's how I'd picture it. <laughs> okay, go on. I'm a cop, bro. The gold. It ain't even worth repeating. It was that stupid. <laughs> Who said this? I don't remember. I didn't know any of them. That was the funniest part. They gave me a fucking history lesson. They were lecturing me about the West. Where about was it the about it, everything. Yeah, the Del Lobos. Fucking, it was a mixed match. Fucking ex-Pale Panthers. Fucking 
Fucking Queen the fucking Queen of the West Isabella's gone and fucking know any of them. Bunch of Muppets. Shit shovelers. Alright, fine, let's go shoot him. <laughs> he just laughed. I could hear him laugh under his breath. Fuck them too. Let's go shoot him. <laughs> he just laughed after. You know, preacher, I got this new theory I've been I've been thinking on. What's that? I reckon we're already in hell, preacher. What do you think about that one? <laughs> oh, this is a trial, this is a tribulation. No, 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 no. The fuck did you just say? Preacher, preacher look trial, around. Tribulation. You say it's a trial and tribu tribulation? <laughs> tribulation. Tribulation. Yes. Oh, this ain't no test, preacher. Preacher, you got the preacher, you got the devil in you today. The Buddhists believe the same thing. <laughs> no, I just got you've been it. you've been possessed. We've been to that apple. I ain't possessed. I'm loving this. I'm loving these shaders, man. Look at this. Dude, trotting around like this is so underrated, bro. Trotting like this. Screw, screw, fucking riding everywhere so fast, man. Do this more often. This is so fun. you still get joys in this life. Just chatting. Yeah, just from I think we've done a fucking stuff. we've done a roundabout loop. We've been going in circles, and I haven't even been paying attention. This is over if you think you're going to hell, and if you get there. Think about it. It's like cruising on a highway, just cruising, just chatting. I wish we rode horses, still, man. I wish. Fuck cars. I think all the miseries to be found is here. Life would have been so much better riding around like this oh. with your friends. Hell ain't half full. Killing people. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> for a lot more misery than you know. Hmm. I won't be too sure, preacher. I won't be too sure. <laughs> it's a joke. The Buddhists believe that you reincarnate if you cannot find enlightenment in this life. It is maybe similar to this trial and tribulation. If I make it out alive out of all this shit, I'm going to become a monk. I can teach you. You're going to become a what? A monk. Monkey? Bullshit. No, a monk, right? I can say it. You're already bald like one. How do you figure you're going to become a monk? Well, if I don't, if I live through this, which, uh, yeah, I'd say there's like, Five percent chance, maybe, maybe. You know, all, all this talking about you're gonna die, you're gonna die. I know the chances of this. They look terrible. What we're going to war always is. But you know the man who thinks he's lost the fight has already lost before he even gets in the ring. That oh, is I true. Don't plan, I don't plan to lose no fights, but look at the water with the shaders. Die. Look at the water, guys. You know what? This looks like the. Really I think this shooter. looks like the Red Dead trailer more. I can't remember the gameplay trailer, but I'm pretty sure this is what it looked like. It looks more realistic. Eventually. But not today. Not this war. Uh, maybe not this war, but there'll always be another. I hope not. For once. Hope all you want. And there'll always be more bullets for you to put in your gun. Yeah. Keep your pockets heavy. Other than that, what's there's a moan about? Speaking of pockets being heavy, I'm glad you took that fella out with the gun first because Wallaby had six fucking guns on him. I couldn't move an inch. <laughs> he had six guns on him? Something like that. Fucking three repeaters, fucking th three navies. He had a fucking pump shotgun up his asshole. Oh, so that's that's why you weren't able to. Okay, yeah, I see. Pump shotgun. I should have done that, so that fucker was stuck. Holy shit. That's uh, that's the gun only only uh, law can have, right? Sheriffs. Man, they only issue the sheriffs. I want a pump shotgun before I die. 
You know, maybe if I had a pump, I think our odds go up pretty, pretty good. I can go buy one. I got enough money. How much you think they go for? However much I want them to go for. Give me a good deal, I shoot you in the head. That's the fucking option. <laughs> Fair enough. I like that option. What are they gonna do? Report me to the law? They got an illegal firearm. <laughs> That's true. Yeah, people got it all twisted. Robbing civilians, sure they got money, but you know they're gonna tell the law and you're going to prison. Robbing outlaws. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe that's what we should do. We should, we should, we should, we should rob all the outlaws and go back up north and distribute the wealth between the people. <laughs> what, are, what are they gonna do? Go to the law. Yeah, Rob and Kelly. That's right. Steal from the scumbag. Gonna build up Colter to be a massive city in the snow. Give to the townies. James Hood. Go pick up some uh, some eye masks. We'll be vigilantes. Go join that Lionel Williams guy. Yeah, no, thank you. Yeah, I would. I know Richie. <laughs> you know, I think if we ride around like this more, we won't crash our horses ever. You know what? I like this pace at certain times. This is nice, you know. Get to take in everything. It's a beautiful world. To enjoy it every now and then. While yeah, you have the chance. It has its consolations. Check the check telegrams. I love the ah, oh, dude. My favorite thing about the snow is the outfits you can wear in them, dude. Like the, the warm, the warm clothes in this game are so much better than the fucking other ones. You can actually look like a, you can make a realistic outfit. The other ones are all fucking bright and shit and leather and silk and fucking golden crusted cornflakes, man. I don't give a shit about immersion. I'm not taking this coat off when we get to the desert. I don't give a shit. James Kelly can overheat and die. At least he'll die with style. John sent me a screenshot of his city character. He looks terrible, guys. His character looks terrible, guys. Had to say it. Just had to say it. Had to admit it, man. Dude, it reminds me of, uh, you got, guys, you gotta be an OG to remember this, but, you remember, 
when we made Boz C Corrigan, you remember the guy that was with us? The guy with the really good New York accent? Forget what his name was, but you remember him? Adrian, I think. Adrian Lugera. Sick, sick RP, by the way. I, I met him on uh, GTA RP. Text RP, actually. Um, he reminds me of... John's new character looks exactly like his character model. That guy was so hilarious. It was during James Kelly's Emerald Ranch arc with Billy. And I know because uh, I stopped playing Boz because of the, all you guys trolling me. I stopped playing... Um, I can't even remember. What, what was his real name, dude? All I know is Boz now because you made it up. What the fuck was his... Something... Oh yeah, Lorenzo. Lorenzo Lucarelli, that's right. Yeah, he got murdered, but my character killed him, yeah. Boz killed him. Because <laughs> he... Because he kidnapped the, the Marla's uh, organized crime character. <coughs> and then Enzo shot him in the head. Oh, that was funny. Did that whole arc trying to take Blackwater Saloon from Peter? <laughs> that was hilarious. Selling illegal meat. <laughs> Fucking uh, the mob hitmen, dude. That was sick. That was so sick. I wish I had a good accent. That could have been really good. Um... And then, yeah, I stopped playing Enzo for a bit, and his character was at around Emerald Ranch. Um, and he met James Kelly, and he was, <laughs> he was trying to undercut the gem market with Solomon. He was about to get murdered. Billy Joe went and told Solomon, and there was that whole big thing, dude. It was fucking. That was so funny. That was so funny. What are you guys, uh, transporting? Wait, who's huh? that? James Kelly, nice to meet you. Oh, hey, James. Thomas was we met once before. Thomas who? Woods. Long time ago. Thomas Woods. Hmm. <laughs> Guys hunting. Yeah, yeah we're hunting. That's uh, that's one yeah. word for it. Mm -hmm. How about y'all? Y'all hunting? No, no, we ain't. We got some more in the bushes, so we're kind of you know baiting people along. Hopefully, get some law dogs. I see, I see. Yeah, yeah. The interesting looking honey pot. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'll say you weren't really stuck on the train tracks. Uh huh. And well, uh, good luck. That's the most obvious trap. <laughs> Tom, what did he say his name? Thomas Woods? Oh, I never met that fella before. We may have robbed him. I've always, I've always wondered what normal life would be like as a townie, you know, just situations like that, what people would do to me. They rob you. Take your possibles. And more. Yes, they would take his possibles. Hungry country. 
It's just, we're right outside of our Don Preacher. This ain't hungry country. This is, this is fucking, are you playing the banjo? Are you playing the fiddle on your fucking horse? This is fucking Muppet country. This is real country. This is hungry country. This is skinny country. Hungry Muppet country. Well, they're all types of countries. They've all got qualities to them. This is America, by the way. <laughs> As James feel about preacher, that he needs to rein him in more. Everyone's gotta eat. And you gotta rob Peter to pay Paul. And you gotta pay Paul to get food. Now you just reviews an old shit. You have to pay Paul. Or fuck oh, Paul. You gotta rob Peter to pay Paul. You never heard that? I gotta pay the fucking uh, the fucking pet store to oh, make it Benjamin to make you a muzzle. I'm here with Chris Ray. <laughs> I'm gonna play a new tune called <laughs> Soldier Song. A muzzle. Oh, I need a muzzle. I think you're running out of quotes, Breacher. <laughs> I've, I've heard you reuse the same, same ones for the last three days. You need to read a new Bible, new translation. I don't like that. Why don't you start calling me Master Josie? James Kelly, the Northern Warlord. <laughs> Damn you of the snow, guys. Hope you're ready for the war. They're in Van Horn. Nah, we, we won't do anything until we see him with Jesse. Okay. I'm gonna keep to my word, Jesse's the one we want. We know what's gonna happen after. But I don't have to be like that right now. I guess the uh, the winter coat makes sense when it's night. Cause it is cold in the desert at night. I love the scenery here. I love the the plains. It's probably my second favorite biome in Red Dead. But whenever I see this grass, man, I just feel itchy. Because you know that this grass, we have a lot of this grass in Australia. It's fucking itchy, man. It's fucking itchy. It's sharp and itchy. I hate it. King Ranch Blue Stem. That sounds like a Pokemon.
The reclamation of thieves, Thievos Landos. Rename this place the Rat's Den, fellas. Is this where the golds live. I think it's fun. No one, no one believed Kelly when he said that. Richie and the golds were schemers, man. These motherfuckers memed, memed Robbie Gold's story. <laughs> they tarnished the gold name and reputation. They turned it into a fucking rats. None of them believed Kelly, man. Now look. Innovation Nation Station. What are we waiting for? Roach. Roach? Oh, Roachy. That's what comes. You doing? Oh, Roach, that's pretty fucked up. He's changing the saddlebags. I still don't know if I like him very much. Easy now. I think he's all right. I think he's got a past. He's not really telling. Can you stop us. playing that fucking banjo? <laughs> and I shove that fiddle up your ass. Listen, all right. I like it. I like it. Don't listen to him. It's a very nice fiddle. There's joy in music. Is my magic in music? I just stop talking like you're gonna shit yourself. What do you mean? There's magic. That man in Mulling, the Mulling, the Mulling, the shit coming. I just got fucking strange. The Mulling, the Mulling, the Mulling. When the day darkens, the, 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 the goblins come from the valley and the fucking Bible and the fucking, uh, the fucking King Joseph the Second. King Joseph the Second had an aneurysm and popped out a golden goose, and that golden goose is the prophet. That's not in the Old Testament. I just got strangled, James. What is the difference between the old and the well, the old Violence. No, old is everything up to Christ, and the new is everything Christ thereafter. Oh, I see. So after he died, it's separated by Christ, which is Christ being a uh, piece of God. Some believe the God sent to the earth to die. For all man's sins. Tell me, do the uh, do the Methodists believe in the Holy Spirit? Uh, they do. Why? I could never figure it out. Some 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 of them don't believe in the Holy Spirit. Some of them only believe in Jesus. Some of them don't believe in Jesus. Yeah, well, a lot of us are different. I'm I'm a little bit of an amalgamation of everything. I like all of them. Yeah, I believe this. There's power in Mars' blood. I believe in saints. I pray to them. Mars? Ain't that a Greek god? Or is that a Roman god? That's a Roman one, ain't it? Mars. 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 The planet. I ain't making fun of it. I'm saying Mars is a Roman god. Didn't you know that? Yeah, he is. Okay. Got a war. But martyrs. Yeah, there are people who died for... I think we all know what martyrs are for you. Yeah, we do. We all know well. Yeah, I remember, uh... Little Jimothy called Effie May a martyr. <laughs> Effie May Braithwaite. Did she die? Yes, at the hands of the Dicenzos. You have to, to, to order to be a martyr, you have to die. Sure. I've heard live, live men being called martyrs too, by fucking idiots. Then they clearly don't know what the hell that means. No, they don't. Because they think it's just a hero or something. I'm a martyr of the cause. You gotta get yeah. shot first, you dumb fucker. <laughs> I am not uh, very good at Grish yet, but I know for a fact there are no such thing as a living mother. It is a bunch of uh, bullshit. <laughs> bunch of bullshit? Mm -hmm. What do you mean? He just agreed with what you're saying, Bridger. Oh, okay. Oh. <laughs>
I want I want someone to fucking like uh, just talk shit to Kelly and then uh, Orochi <laughs> Orochi just beheads him with a katana. <laughs> Leaves his head from his shoulders with a katana. That was a backflip. Yeah, and bows. <laughs> fucking cuts his head off. <laughs> oh, it just cuts her head off. <laughs> It'll be like that thing they do in uh, fucking animated, and they they fucking cut the head, and then it just like it looks fine, and then it just slides off. Shirtless freak. Yeah, well they come by the masses marching down here. I could kill Bill Seed, yeah. They say this place will be what Valentine couldn't be. Bigger and better. The arm of the dingus. All the same loves and laughs of Valentine, but more. They even have a cafe. Who's that? Miss? Are you deaf? Is that on the back of your horse? It's Isaac. Isaac Quill? Yes. What happened? Got shot. I, I need to get him to. Yeah, go ahead. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, go ahead. Ooh, Hope if I get shot, you guys aren't that indecisive. You're gonna get me killed. <laughs> yeah, don't worry. I will kill. Lack of urgency there, huh? Yeah. I thought he was dead. I think you all scared, huh? I think that explains why we ain't got a telegram from Rudy. Yep. I'm gonna go ask him where they're from. Swain's Brown. You know, Swain sounds like a like a general, a Noxian general. You're back in. You want to tell him to meet us out here? Just gonna look at me, huh? Yep. Yeah, all right. You folks got a train schedule now, huh? Yeah. Got them in the east too. They're all over. Real. It's real handy. Yeah, I suppose it is. Real handy. <laughs> yes, I understand what you're insinuating, sir. What am I insinuating? I don't know. What could you possibly be insinuating? Oh. Hey, Jackie, how's it going? Well, could sometimes. Sometimes my eyes gets a little sore, I ain't riding in the saddle all day. I wanna sit down on a fancy train, enjoy a cigar, and fraternize a little bit with my fellow tip westerners. Well sir, I wish oh, everyone, like you know, jacket. shared your sentiment oh, about the trains. Shut the fuck up. Because the old days I'd rob that train, but now I got too much money I don't need to. <laughs> Good for you, sir. That's right, you want some money? Not really. Sure. I don't need money. What do I need money for? Just gonna get took. Get robbed that often? Yes. I got robbed on my way here. I got robbed yesterday in the high value train. You need a you need a medal or something working out here. Everyone, uh, 
Uh, Henrietta needs a fucking medal, Jesus Christ. She has lost her marbles. So she should move to fucking I, uh, Tahiti. How do you know about Tahiti? What do you mean, how do I they know about Tahiti? told you about Tahiti. It's none of your damn business how I know about Tahiti, sir. My inclination for tropical islands is not a damn lick of your business. Don't tell anybody about that place. Everybody in their dream. Don't you shush me, boy. <laughs> Smoke too much cigar. <laughs> Putting this away. As Enred are doing, I uh, bumped into her yesterday. I uh, didn't actually see her, but I fucking heard her. Sounded like a. Fuck me. Fuck me. And call me Sally. I can game speak. Maximum number of connections with the same identity. Who's still in my identity? Fuck off. There's only one Jimmy here. <clears throat> all right, all right. We you good now? Oh, yeah, I'm good. You know who isn't good though. Most people. Henrietta, she's going insane. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock. Who the fuck's Sherlock? <laughs> I don't know. It's an expression. Is he from Tahiti? Uh, no, I don't think that's a Tahitian name, sir. What is a Tahitian name? I need to know for when I go over there with my fake identity. Yeah, hold on, let me go. It was, it was Rudy. They and, shot down a yeah, shut the f Shut up. Shut the f What the fuck? Oh. You dumbass. Uh, listen, that's a stupid that's bitch. Story, that's the story I read. Listen, that's... Station. That's the story See, this ice, they got the damn train uh, schedule in now. Your damn horses waddle up on the thing. I don't say nothing about that. You come air your dirty laundry out. What, what, what am I supposed to do with that information? Uh, you, you don't think I'm I'm obligated to do something? Every Listen, time I, I was telling him about a story I read hey, as a child. Just, Listen, yeah. all right, you worried about the fucking letters that you got to send, right? That was a story I read as a child. Listen, you ever heard of of the boy and and the man? That's the story, all right? Hey, who wrote that? You know who wrote that? Who wrote that? Yeah, the guy. Shakespeare. The boy and the man by Guy Shakespeare. That's yes. right. All right, well, that checks out. Yep, that's complete. Yep. Mm-hmm. You ever read it? Clearly not. Well, uh, of course I have. There's the guy and the man, and they do some things. Well, don't forget about don't forget about the stuff. Place, of course, of course, the stuff is very integral to the plot. Yes. How about that Tahitian name? I wasn't kidding. Uh, uh, well, I don't know why you expected me to. It's have fucking some. snowing. I expected to have some. Is it snowing? Where are you talking? About? Sorry, the sand just looks fucking really white right now. He's losing it. I'm going blind, you see. Except the construction workers, they need a fine job. You didn't, you didn't find her, you didn't find her. I've, I just said that. Yeah, but when I see it with my own eyes, you know, it's a little... Uh-huh. You know, I, listen, I, when people I, tell you I, stuff, you're like, yeah, whatever. And then I you take see it for yourself, you're like, wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think he didn't find that Tahitian name. No, there's no Tahitian names back here. I don't know why I thought there would have been. Hmm. Well, you can't go wrong with a John Doe. I think I'll just go by Guy. Well, then they'll or think fella. The story. No, I don't think you wrote the story. The man and the boy. Fella. No, it's not the man. It's the boy and the man written Sorry, by the, the guy. The See, boy listen, and the you man gotta, you gotta, you gotta study up on your on your history here. That's the problem. Damn. I gotta study up on medications that'll make me numb to everything that everyone says. I'm gonna lose my mind working this tap job. Seen any interesting folks come in out here since the uh, gentrification of this poor town. What the, what does that word mean? Place has been gentrified. 
<laughs> you mean decolorized? Ruined. They killed all the color of people and sent them away. The ones that lived. Ruined. It's been ruined. Yeah. 1960s? I don't know. Did you see the casino? That, that was God pretty damn nice. It. I got a casino here. Yeah, they got all... It's like the, the boat in St. Denis. They got everything but poker up in the up in the thing. Oh. That's yeah, so all the pointless shit. Yeah, I suppose. Okay. How you gonna, how you gonna, how you gonna fucking build a casino in Armadillo in the West without I don't poker? Know, it's in some private room. Now they're all gonna go to the fucking fort to play poker. As poor innocent gamblers. Killed because they were trying to play a hand of poker. Yeah. <laughs> Gotta know when to hold them. <laughs> that was no, better than, that was better than anything preachers poker. said this past week. <laughs> Oh, you uh, take I it easy, Mr. Train know, Man. He say a lot of quips? He's in the uh, book. He's in the guy book. Yep, yep, the guy book. Oh, you take care. Jesus. Fuck. Gotta know when to. <laughs> gotta know when to fold them. Jesus fucking Christ. What? Since when they got fucking somebody working back there now? They've always had people working there. It's just you know they used to yeah, take the days off. Fucking, you know they fucking you know. Yeah, they did. They did. Never used to be so fucking nosy. Hell, it was anything but nosy. He wanted us to fuck off. I suppose I did come in there. The damn shirt on, delinquent. He's got a shirt on. What the hell's wrong with you? Oh, it's, it's skin color. I can't see it. <laughs> now this fella doesn't have a fucking shirt on. The damn shirt on, you delinquent. <laughs> That's Drew. What are you doing without a shirt on? Because I... This I no shirt, no service. I need my sweater that I had on. It was a little too hot, so... See what I'm wearing? You don't think I'm hot? Well, I you gotta, was fucking you gotta hot, sweat okay. like a man, alright? It's a price you gotta pay. The style. Oh, well, if you wanna throw dollar bills at me, I mean, you, you most certainly can. Sounds like rude boys might be at the fort. Well, they could have oh. left, actually. Hey, well, they just shot down, uh... Yeah, 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 yeah. a chance, if you're back in Colter, wouldn't mind having a talk with you. Yeah, I'll be up there uh, after this conversation, all right? Sure, give, me, uh, give me 30 minutes to an hour. All right, perfect. So, all right, y'all take care. Dude, the West looks... Amazing with the shaders. Look at that. Look at that. Looks so realistic, guys. You know what? I need to play. I need to play The Witcher. I've. I hope my save file didn't get like corrupted or anything. I think I think Joe's is up top. That's what I'm gonna do. Actually, I'm gonna install The Witcher after stream. I only got like a quarter way through. Ellen and Josie were going. Might be helping some of the folks. What do you mean by that? Oh, look. oh fuck. Oh. Here's to be holding. I know treasure in the saloon, buddy. Ain't no treasure under the floorboards, trust me. Yeah, you find some, some bones. What are you looking for, man? Oh, vampires. I done hear that there's vampires here in Armadillo. Yeah, I've been trying to come down here and find some. Hey, uh, you ain't seen nothing uh, going bump in the night. Yeah. Like that. Let me tell Boy, you something. Hmm? All the fucking vampires have been extinguished. All the vampires have been extinguished? You yeah, never heard of uh, Van Kelsing? Van Kelsing? No, I ain't heard of this. Is this another vampire? Which which slash vampire? That's right, correct. But there ain't no vampires in Armadillo. But but there is a witch in Van Horn. A witch? That's right. A witch, also known as the Seer. She put a hex on my friend. That's turned right. his turned his blood into 
into uh, mud. You blew the mud. Well, that don't sound right. Oh well, if there certainly is, uh, you're sure there ain't no vampire here at all. Well, it's good news. All right, vamp. No, yeah. Like I came down all here for nothing, then. Now you gotta head up the van on and find the seer, the witch, and behead her. That's, That's right. the only way to kill her. Wait. You gotta bring her, hat, her decapitated head back here, and, and plant it in the middle of the street, and then chant around it. Well, I'm sort of going to go see if I can find some silver arrows then. Yeah, uh, that'll help deal with these kind of beasts and whatnot. It deals with vampires and maybe the worst. Only Watch out! If she starts, if she starts chanting in Latin, you're already dead. Yeah. Chanting Latin. Even just one word. If you hear one word, just uh, I don't know. Say your prayers. Oh, all right then. Uh, yeah, I'm going to take a little look around, just to, just a little peek, see around town, just to make sure that the claims of all these vampires uh, are, are true, and that they ain't no one's here. And I'll head on to see if I can deal with this witch problem, you hear? You're doing God's that work. Great. All right, that... then. All right, then. Jesus fuck it. Uh, yes? Stop calling him that. Please stop calling him that. I'm okay, listening to you. Uh, I am sure Please. you heard what happened, or no? Yeah, yeah, we're just grabbing Josie. Get to speak to him. Josie is treating. Josie is treating Zip. How long is this gonna take, Josie? Up real quick. We should be done. This is Anders Lauren down. Shit. Can someone finish the stitching? Yeah, just go. Don't get fucking right. caught for me. Go. Okay, just I'll pressure okay. until someone can uh. Come up to the uh, he, he read erotic novels, he can stitch me up. Come to the come to the uh, ranch if you need to speak to me, uh, is it is that a safe table? Yes. Did you shoot that guy cause his voice annoys you? If if you were allowed to do that, James Kelly would have been killed already. <laughs> Sunny, sunny to be honest. I get very self-conscious about Sunny's voice. I'm not self-conscious because it's not myself, but conscious. Demon. Apparently, rude boys are at the fort. That's what they were saying, yeah. Out there, there still. Do we have blood with them? No, 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 no. Okay. I have a good friend in Rude Boy. Yeah, Rude Boy Rudy used to ride with us. Alright. He's actually the reason I'm, I'm even here. Yeah, well, I just had a very difficult decision to make. Turn his back on his annoying pest of a friend or ride with us. Hey, that mother, that dirty little fuck spat on me. I never yeah, been spit on before. He did do that. For no fucking reason either. Cause I had a, cause I, cause I had an argument with Remy. He fucking spat on me, the dirty little shit. <laughs> oh yeah, Boz Corrigan would have annoyed you. I can't even remember what it sounded like. Does anyone have a Boz Corrigan clip? I want to listen to it just for old times' sake. Yeah, I'll never forget. We went to hold, we went to hold up a saloon, and uh, a deputy was in there, and he just starts beating the shit out of the deputy for no reason. <laughs> you all praised him for it too, and asked why he should fucking ride with us. That was the number one thing he kept saying. That was his only redeeming quality, then wasn't even redeeming. Ain't nobody here. Where they left? I think Rudy's uh, 
Using the tactics I taught him. I think he's going real gorilla right now. <laughs> well, they sure as shit got him good. They get all of them. Yeah, they they tied up Hannah or someone. Had her send a telegram that she wanted to speak to Zip of the Fort. They all came there and fucking ambushed them. Wow, they got them that way. Yeah, that's how, that's how they got them. Jesus. That is guerrilla warfare. Yeah. Sadly. Okay. So <laughs> did you not do you? We need to go back to Armadillo. Swing. Ah shit. Yeah, there's law in Armadillo though. We gotta be careful. Only three of them, they might have I think they might have overheard me talking about Josie and for reinforcements, who knows? Well Josie's wanted, I think it's safe to assume we're all wanted, no? I don't know. Unless I it's for Richie. Yeah, but me and Preacher, there was only two of us, and there was three of them, they didn't even speak to us. If they tried to take up. Josie, can I kill them? Um... If you have to. Okay. I love how... <laughs> Dude, the shaders look so good right now. <laughs> Master... <laughs> This is so sick, dude. This is so sick. We have our loyal servant, man. We have our own. We have our own fucking outlaw. We have our own fucking outlaw. Uh, um, deputy coyote, man. We have our own outlaw serban, man. What is this? Oh my god, no. You found it. I was lying. I didn't want to hear it. goes for 20 it minutes. Be an issue, okay? Maybe you can still salvage all of this shit. But as far as I'm concerned, he's not fucking happy. So you need to be open and fucking honest with him because We'll watch this later. Like we'll watch this full thing later. We'll watch it later. We'll watch it later. <laughs> <coughs> I'm getting secondhand embarrassment. What well, howdy gentlemen? I'll be Ernie Joe. What brings y'all to town? The water. Water? Well, there's a barrel right over there. Feel free to help yourselves. Go on now, you deputy. Yeah. I think so, Mr. Kelly. <laughs> Name's Tom. Deputy Tom. Yes, no. Hey. What was that? What was that? I said you here to enjoy armadillo. Enjoy. Enjoy is a strong word. Maybe, uh... Maybe... Nah, I ain't en nah, I'm not enjoying this place. Couldn't think of anything else. I just had some fucking. Everywhere. I had some fucking psychopath come up to me and ask if there's any vampires here. And I thought, maybe, without the cholera, the pestilence, and the disease, maybe the freaks would move elsewhere. And it might be alright. Now, is it Quill still out here? <laughs> it was protecting us, the disease. 
These we not those who don't belong. By chance. Oh, okay, that's good. That's good. Are you uh, stationed out here? Yep, that I am. Big boy's bill around. He was. He ain't anymore. Yeah, nocturnal now or something. Only wakes up in the dark early hours of the morning. He's needed his beauty rest. I don't know if you've seen him lately. I haven't seen him in a long, long time. Sure, he got a boom town to attend to, I guess. Yeah, he's a busy fella, busy fella. We're doing shifts now. All the brawl fights and cheated hucksters. A lot to attend to. Well, that's true, that's true. They all crawled out of Fort Mercer. You reckon? We crawled out of Fort Mercer. I reckon they crawled out from out east. Reckon I saw them coming this way. And I reckon right. There's been a few caravans come on through here. They're good folk. Civilian folk. Ain't the majority of them dead? Yeah, yes. That's besides the point. First one was like 85% dead. But the second one is only 75. So it's progress. Give us another year. We'll probably have a caravan full of survivors. Did, did I not tell? Did I not say this to you, preacher? Yeah. This, is, this is exactly what they fucking do. What? I don't know if I said it to you, or if I said it to you, or if I said it to you, or you over there. But I said this. As long no, as I got one survivor, there. they'll keep fucking sending more. Mm -hmm. I know. Till this place is same to me. Reborn. Now it's gonna be Blackwater first. Oh. Hellfire. So I want to blow this place back up to the damn Stone Age. <laughs> I ain't insinuate nothing. I'm just saying. They better not be insinuating anything. I'll have you know that we built this out of the finest lumber. And nothing yeah. breaks down. Yeah, fire. Yeah, I told you. I fucking told you. Valentine. Okay, we we'll just a little. Valentine like reincarnated. Reach up. Oh, Jesus, fuck. Don't kill the fucking vampire hunter. He's gonna go kill that witch that you fucking want dead. I've already put him on a mission. Leave him be. Hey. Hey. You're insane. Hey, freak. I told you to go to Van Horn, motherfucker. Yeah, what the, the hell? The vampire's here. Get your ass up to Van Horn and go kill that damn witch. No, you don't understand the vampire. He's here. Where is he? Show me the vampire. I'll see if I can fuck. Okay. Uh, Come on, let's go. Come on. Hurry up. Get a wriggle on. Yeah, go! What is Shit! There he is! There's the impression! It's the Daywalker! Daywalker, get him! Daywalker. You get him! Hey, you! Alright, then. The jig is up! You ain't no joking joke about that! Kill him! He's the one who tried whoa, to bear me! He tried to bear his fangs at me and whatnot! He's a vampire, ain't he? You better yeah, spin him up! I can That's see it! I can see it! He looks like one! He's showing me! He's lying! He's lying! I am not a vampire! Come on, give us a give us a big toothy smile! Yeah. I am not a vampire! You are your baby! Hold on! I got some garlic rub! Go you don't make sure you don't go to I got some garlic and rub it all over! You watch! You, 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 uh, no, 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 no! You gotta make I a choice now! I've had the garlic! I was joking with that fella, and he fell for it. Yeah, yeah, Okay, that's okay look, this is what you need to do, fella. When he comes back, you tell him that you're only kidding. There's a, uh, there's a witch in Van Horn. You tell him that, all right? There's or the seer. There's a, there's a witch in Van Horn called the seer. You tell him that, all right? She yeah. makes vampires. Dang. I can't find no garlic, bro. Hey, 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 this fella just said something real interesting. What you, what you, who, what you, what you, wait, stay back There's a, uh... There's a witch in Van Horn. She yeah. leads us vampires, and she, uh, if you kill her, all the vampires I'm die too. Is it what now? There's a witch. Well, would you Van tell me? This is like a trick. You can't listen to vampires. They're all the same. Well, they're they're gonna I think you don't want you to kill them. They're gonna bite you, and they're gonna drink your blood. You're not my friend. I am Japanese. I never die. 
There's it's a vampire. Impossible to kill. Not a vampire. There's a witch in Van Horn. You can take my my word for it. Japanese people never lie. <laughs> I don't like this. But you say it's in Van Horn. He's a witch. Van Horn. Her name is the Seer. She's very evil. All right. Well, in the meantime, uh, you you have to you have to re you, you have to stay indoors because if you're gonna be coming out, you're gonna be you you your your, your mm. thirst for blood is gonna okay, overtake yeah. you. You gonna start biting folk. All right. You need to stay indoors. You know, if you don't get us soon, the whole world will fall under her curse. You better Wouldn't hurry. Wouldn't I be burning if I was a vampire? The witch is trying to the witch is trying to launch. Like like the yeah, yeah. the witch is trying to cover the. Uh... Oh, there he goes. Ain't working, is it? This ain't fucking working. Listen, we gotta just convince him to kill that guy. I, 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 so that's I like that guy. No, I don't. It would be better to see him uh, do something at least. He's a vampire. Kill him. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. He's gonna kill him. Kill him. Get down. Get down. He's shooting arrows. Oh, fuck. Kill him. Shut up. <laughs> Let me out of here. Listen, fight him to the death. No, nope. you gotta deal with this now. You gotta go nowhere. Keep the dog closed. And if you kill him, you're gonna go take his place and kill that witch in Van Horn. He's a vampire. Kill him. Based on, okay. Jed, I am not a vampire. I'm where? Downstairs. Where? I don't want to get bit. Drew Peters, get your sweaty ass out of here. No, I want to yeah, see this. Shut up. This is getting good. Stop. Shut up. Stop. Shut up. Shut up. It's getting good. It's getting... Shut up. I'm trying to listen. He just showed us his fangs. What the hell are you all talking about? I saw them. Is that the vampire right there? Is that the vampire with the bow? He's trying to trap you. I threw an onion at him and he started burning. I don't know if I believe you He showed us his fangs. It's all a lie. Oh, Go to the church down the road, get some holy water, and throw it at him. But these people never die. He is a vampire. <laughs> I, I am ordained. Just give me a bottle of water. I'll, I'll ordain it and then you can throw it at him. Actually, preach, aren't you ordained too? No, I ain't ordained. Oh, shit. Yeah! Oh, he's striking! No! Oh, oh shit! shit. Alright! One of you's gotta right, kill each other! He's trapped in this area, you know where the way out. Alright! Now, you all cannot make sure that he leaves, alright? You gotta kill him, man. You gotta be the hero. No, you gotta go yeah. kill the witch in Van Horn. Aren't you the vampire hunter? Isn't I it am your the job? Vampire hunter. Look, if you're, you're not gonna kill him, who is? Oh, you rat! Okay, I go get. Don't I go here, Jed. I'm gonna bite you. I, I'm oh, starting you heard to think. that? You okay. heard he's gonna bite you. Did you I hear that? I am starting to think you're right, a real vampire hunter. Right. Okay, psst. All right. uh, I think you're Here's crazy. the idea. Wait, I hold think on. Uh, right. What? But I got this here. This is this. This will make sure you don't come outside. No, no. Here, I'll leave this right here. Oh. There we go. Okay. You, you yeah, aren't a real vampire that. hunter. You're just a liar. Yeah, that. That one is a rot. That one's all rotten and everything like that. They, 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 everybody knows that like dead rats. They don't like them. Like they, 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 they really don't like them. Okay. I got. I thought vampires like rats, though. Oh, no, 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 that's a myth. Listen, that's just a myth. Go put, go put an arrow in that guy's head. Uh, you know, so oh, here's rats. what we need to do. Okay, oh, I I'm going to go get my like rope. And I see if we can't we can overpower him and ties him up and everything like that. Once they, no, no, this perhaps... isn't we. It's not we. You got to do this, man. I know. You're, you're the hunter, well, you're right? The hunter. Well, he's you're the hero strong. here. All right, so here, I'll go get my rope. I'll be back in a minute. Sure, you don't leave none or anything, because you can try to try to overpower him. Keep him inside. I'll be right back. I'll go get my rope. I got a rope. You want mine? Oh, okay. All right, who's taking bets? Who's taking right bets? He... Oh, 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 I, got, I got 10 bucks on blue shirt. Sure, 10 bucks on blue shirt. Yeah, I will match that bet. You know what? Probably, yeah, you know, I should probably get out, get out of here. Gonna gonna kill that crazy fucker, put him out of his misery. Stop fucking, stop trying to pit him against each other. It's the truth, ain't it? Oh, no, you idiot. Crazy, you stupid fuck. Oh, you no. dumb fuck. Oh. Are you the one he thinks is... Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, God. How many fights you been in? All right. The vampire? Me? Yeah. Uh, like a couple? 
Oh, it got me. Shut up, shut up, shut the fuck up. That wasn't a confident answer. What the hell happened here? He, he slipped. He slipped. Preacher. Hey, what, what happened here? I slipped across James's gun. I'm a vampire. Don't get close to him. You know what? This is a great time to arrest you. But I'm not gonna do that. That'd be stupid. I get shot. Strange. Oh, on. So you are wanted. They shot each other in the middle of the. All right, I'm gonna. Excuse me. When he comes outside, I'll just see if I can get level. That's what that sounds like. I'm gonna make a new outfit. The mystery. I might be in a little bit, so. Uh, I'm gonna make a vampire outfit. I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna come up bite you. Jed, I gotta make this outfit. Are you gonna come and uh, capture me or something? Before I make this outfit, or can I make this outfit? I'm not gonna come outside. He's gonna shoot me. No, he probably has his fucking bow and arrow aimed at the door. No, he doesn't. I'm watching. Why are you so scared, man? <laughs> He's scared. <of> the <laughs> he is not Look at this fucking place. Hey, man. I can kill him. All right, Jed. I got, I'm making my outfit. I ruined this fucking town. They, they did. Valentine never reached heights such as this. I'll show you. I'll find out where he go. He's, he's making an outfit. You missed your he chance. Went invisible. Oh, I lose it. Yeah, I lose it. Oh. yeah, this place really is the new Valentine, huh? Get the fuck out of here. It's, it's worse. Armadillo is the new Valentine. Where's Josie? Oh. Let's try a beast. Uh, good night, pain. What do you say? What do you say? Take the train? Yeah, I'd be okay with that. Western train. That was a great nap. Wonderful. How you doing there, Bennett? Doing good. How much for uh, how much for a ticket? Uh, five dollars. Yeah, it'll be five dollars to me. Just give me a second. Yeah. I've never been on a train before, except for the one time. I've never been on a train before, except for that one time. <laughs> I will need, I will unfortunately need everyone to just kind of, you know, look away from the train for just a moment, maybe think about something else. Okay. Right, just don't, just don't look at the train, all right? I just, I just have to clean something off. It's a little unmentionable. Just, just turn, okay. just turn right around. You know what? Hey, you're not, man, you're not my master. You. Hey, just turn right around. I got this, this train has to move for a second. Over you're there. not my master. Yeah, just, uh, yeah, just, no, just don't over over your ass from the train, okay? Yeah. Nothing. What can you know? Just this. You are not my master. <laughs> I love Orochi. Oh, damn, Gus took it back to the eye. Oh, damn it. Oh, I'll be right back, folks. I hate this fucking job. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> uh. I don't know.
Always, always gosh darn sinkholes. Yeah. Quicksand. Did he take it to get cleaned? Mate, I don't, uh, I don't, I don't rob trains no more, Mr. Tom. No more. No I mean, more. No more. Done it before. What do you think no more implies, fella? <laughs> Sounds like it's a right, plan. You've done it before. Person. Yeah, no shit. <laughs> How was it? Oh, shit, where did the train go? He's coming. He had to take it he up took, around the bend. Yeah, he yeah. 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 left yeah. without us. The nerve. Yeah, that's right. The nerve on that guy. Had to go replenish the coal. Well, okay. Hey, before we get on this train, is anyone interested in buying a lucky dollar? It's so lucky. lucky about it. How much is it? It lands on heads every single time. Yeah, I'll buy it. Prove it. Yeah, you prove it. Wow. <laughs> every time without fail, it lands on heads. Yeah. <laughs> oh, here comes train. Oh, you could've just... Throwing it on your head. Well, Clever. I think this is the wrong dollar. I might have left it in my room. Pre-check. I think you can say thou shall not pass, and then it won't come. No, I think it will crush me like a bug. Hey, there's a. But you are holy, man. It's your deputies. No, I ain't ordained. Uh, it doesn't matter. I see two. I see four. All right, I got the train back, folks. I'm terribly sorry about that. Yep. I'll just go around. Feel free to get on the fucking train. Thank you, sir. Oh. Hold on, I'm gonna pay for our posse. All right. Swing. There's twenty. Okey dokey. Come on with us. Pay for the, the money to get on the All right, that'll don't be worry five about that. dollars a head, please. Four of these been paid for. Four of four us. These four over here. Need a little more. You ain't getting on, fella. All right, you can pass me your five dollars, sir, and you can hop on. You go, feller. Where's, uh, where's this train going, anyway? Uh, just in a loop, just to go look around at all the pretty sights in the desert. I seen a lot of those today. In time, right here, actually. Mr. Rock, I still owe you my train ticket. Right here. Yep, that'll Same. be, uh, that'll be five dollars, sir. Yep. yep. James. Swain. Swain, James. Hola. <laughs> Howdy. Thank you, sir. Yep, appreciate it. He spent some time. Train will be soon, now. folks. Five dollars ahead. Log it on from? free. Get on free. Y'all are free to disperse uh, about the train at your leisure. There's another flatbed in the back if you don't want to be up front here in the engine. Door. I was hoping this was going to be one of the new fancy trains they made. Fancy trains look so cool, dude. I wanted a fancy train. Not this shit. Where are the fancy trains? I want a fancy train so we can smoke our, so we can smoke our cigar that Wallaby gave us. Yeah, you're really working on your squads today, James. New. 
fucking fix yourself. There's no way that this is my problem. Huh. I have not seen it. Yep. That's what I thought. Okay. You like the snoop pose. Right there, dig your pen. I can't remember that some, fella's uh, name, cigarette. but I know I cut his throat open a long time ago. I bet the law 100% thinks we're about to rob the train. Oh, absolutely. Mm -hmm. <coughs> 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 just waiting. You never smoked a cigar? You're not supposed to inhale, motherfucker. <coughs> What? Oh, Puts hair on your chest. You don't inhale your cigar. Oh man. You're a fucking coward. You're a fucking coward. Yeah, you are supposed to inhale. No, no, no. That's how we do it in Japan. What's the point of yeah, exactly. What's the point of smoking if you ain't gonna inhale it? Listen, yeah. the cigar you don't need to inhale it. You you're getting the flavor. Oh you fool, that's red wine. You meant to swish it around in your mouth and spit it out. That's what you sound like, you pompous prick. We're talking about red no, wine, we're talking about cigars. No, you still get the nicotine buzz from puffing it, man. So, what is your name? The right, right hand, you throw up. Swing. Long arms. If you could Swing. please stow yes, your right. long arms in either, uh, uh, you know, in any of the storage compartments in the, you know, middle car of the train. I bet you stow your head up a donkey's ass. Other than that, stay out of the caboose. <laughs> <laughs> What? Yeah, I'm not. I'm did he not, not hear what I said? Long arm anywhere. Yeah. He didn't he even react. My I don't think he, he cares. <laughs> He's probably heard that a hundred. That was a good times. one too. I thought of that on the spot. I like that, that deserved the reaction. He has not heard that a hundred times. I think he knew that. That deserved the fucking react. Fuck that back. fella. He knew that would hurt you more. I respect that. I don't feel like robbing this train, but I said I wouldn't, so I will not. Eh, yeah, we could. There's nothing to gain off this piece of shit. I heard they got new fancy. I heard they got new fancy ones with their little fucking, uh, their little fucking, uh, little fucking uh, tea parties and shit. And they ain't got shit on this one. It's just fucking wood, wood and metal, wood, metal and coal. I'll rob it. Other watching us. I'm watching them back. Yep. Well, they can Everyone keep watching way. them. <laughs> Where are they gonna go? On the, on the train? Abide with me. Well, they are gonna follow the train. Oh, Jesus Christ. These must be Greenhorn deputies. I didn't hear about the last time they tried to do this. <laughs> are you riding so fast? Oh, no. We're not Die. robbing the damn train. Just taking a nice ride. Mind your fucking business. <laughs> what, are, what are you saying? Hey? I can't understand what you're saying, miss. What? Hey? Can you say that one more time? I love bees. Anybody hear what she was saying? It's bees in funny right now. Yeah. Yeah. Mr. Deputy like Tom. Funny, okay. Hey, 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 Tom. I know who you are. I never met you. Oh, you know my name. Oh, terrible things. <laughs> who the fuck is this fella? I am a roach. What did you hear? I heard you was in Sisiko. No one noticed the mis mysterious leather clad, belt clad oh, man. All wrapped up in leather, as cold as the clay. Fella looks, uh, looks tough. Looks like he could. Could fucking, I don't know. Spidey young cowboy down by the, the size of his damn jaw, fellas. He could bite my head off. Like a. Uh, 
Nope. What the fuck is going on on this cursed fucking train? Forget. Train right now. What? It, Something about the conductor falling off. That would explain as to why. Where are we? The desert ain't built for trains, that's all I'll say. This place is cursed. The conductor fell off. Oh, we're on a rogue train. <laughs> okay, oh, I'm not captain. No. Don't worry, Orochi will get us out of this. I'm not getting off this train, I paid five bucks for this. This train is ours now. The, who the fuck was that? Well, uh, we prefer it that way. Well, I mean, if you guys know how to move this train, sure. But I can take it out. I can't die today, I have an auction to hold. Can y'all stop the train, maybe? Hell! How do we stop the train? Just bring me some dynamite. I think... I think if you get all the deputies down here and play your horses into the front of it, it might slow down. Why look like a conductor? I don't know what to do! This rogue train doesn't explain the mysterious fucking man we saw in the fucking... in the, in the, in the middle of the train. Yeah, it doesn't. Wait, wait, where is that guy? No, not the conductor. No, 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 no. here asking where he was. Yeah, I think he fell off the train too. Oh, shit. Okay, he's blowing into the fire. It's fine. It's fine. He's blowing the fire out. It's okay, we got it. Anybody see the conductor at all, though? There's someone inside of the tracks. Oh, I don't see nobody. Okay. I don't think we're going to get banned for someone disconnecting on a train, dude. Oh, yeah, there's somebody up there tied to the track. What? Yeah. You bullshitting? Yeah. Last one. <laughs> you got me. Uh, <laughs> I've done that to somebody before to teach him a lesson. I'll tell you, we're serious. Uh, He's up there. How the fuck did this lady get here? Oh, yeah, Is that Adelaide? Where the fuck did you come from, Adelaide? Oh, I was in the bed. Do you have something to do with this? Do with what? Cast a spell on this train. Didn't recognize you without your jacket fit. Oh. Where the fuck did Adelaide come from? Where's the conductor? He's dead. He's dead. We so we're stuck back on a moving diddle. train? Yeah, yeah that's right. right. It'll go back yeah. to Armadillo. Say your prayers, Emily. And let me tell you something, this train is haunted. We saw a go we saw a ghostly figure in the middle of the platform and he he disappeared. We seen the devil himself. Nope, this is how we all die. On Not this me. train. No. This train is bound it's moving too fast. We couldn't get. We definitely can't just step off and just graze our ankles. We will. We will die if we fall off this train going 0 0.5 kilometers per hour. We are. We are. We are doomed. We are doomed. We are doomed, guys. We are all gonna die. <laughs> Deputies, please save us. We're going to die. How long does coal burn for? Forever. We are doomed. We're doomed. We're all going to die. Uh, I hate to be that person, but you know, more and more, I'm just going to start shouting Ladies, for it. gentlemen. Huh? You all paid five dollars for a ticket straight to hell. Oh, there's the conductor. Well, uh, if I'm gonna be honest, I didn't pay for shit. Uh, yeah. The damage the train. Oh my Is god, our savior. You need to find a new career, fella. <laughs> I think that's the conductor. Tell him to stop the train. It's a rogue train, sir. The man won't stop. You're 
closer to a curve and where it is going to derail. Pick up the damn speed. <laughs> Abide with me, fast falls the evening You have a beautiful voice. Thank you. Sorry, sorry. He hear us. Oh, oh, fuck. God damn it. Sold out. We were a little worried you were, um, yeah, you were tired. Okay. Can we get our five dollars back or what? Same thing every day. Okay. 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 Five a.m. to drive this train. Nothing but a What's a shot, really? The rest of the money goes to his family to feed him. And they're only eating scraps. Go sleep it off in a hotel room, you drunkard. You can walk home, Gus. You're a fucking asshole. He's dead, he's defeated, and even his boss <laughs> calls him an asshole when he all he does is uh, try his best. Is Gus deaf or some really can hear us? He tries to be good. We ought to put him down like the sick dog he is. Yeah. <laughs> what a sad lie. <laughs> Why is like he was walking into it? Truly. He has a last will than it. We're pretty close. He deserves to mercy. Did. Love. I get him, man. What a cruel world. Okay. Hey, can we go faster this time, Mr. Conductor? Oh, God, uh, Mr. Conductor? Feasibly can. Okay, can go. I get a refund? Uh, no. Let's see me the eagle. Oh, wow. Okay, we need to get back and say that it's okay. okay. Didn't you yeah. say you didn't even I guess we just as well. No deaths, no refunds. That's I, my uh, I didn't. I'm going to pay for my life. I said the ticket to hell. Oh, I've got this one. This train don't carry no Much faster This train. This train don't carry no gamblers. This train. Don't hit me. Why are you like this? I like it. This is good. Very good. He has a natural. Like all we all we need now is eyes to play his fiddle. Old crap shooters are midnight ramblers. This train don't carry no gamblers. This train. Wow, that is good. Is it too late to jump off? Nope. Oh look, the mysterious. What the fuck? The mysterious man is back. Oh my god. All wrapped up in leather. What the fuck? It's cold as the clay. What do you got to say for yourself? Vengeful spirit. A revenant is what they would call him. I don't think this is the same guy. This, this is, is the same guy. Is it? I remember that jawbone. <laughs> is this the vampire hunter? No, no. No. Oh, this is the person who's gonna kick your ass. Back up. <laughs> my ass? <laughs> you talk to my fan. No way, it's I fucking. So, buddy. <laughs> I like this guy. You better walk away. <laughs> That's what I thought. I like this guy. I like this guy. <laughs> that was very wise of him. Said this is the fella that's about to beat your ass. What the fuck is that man wearing, by the way? Hold on. Roshi, you gotta, you ought to go fucking sm smack that man in the mouth. Yeah. Okay, master. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh my god. Hey, 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 whoa, 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 don't joke him out, Jesus, fuck. Uh... Oh. Oh, no. We're just making, uh, making it worth your five bucks you paid for. Making it worth your money. Make sure nobody gets hit off the train. Ah! Oh, well done, you go. 
The conductor is about to turn his train back home. Oh. oh. Get back here. Yeah. <laughs> we got entertain. We got live entertainment back up. Man. Get him. Man. <laughs> What's he saying? Shit. Mm. I think he likes this. He's enjoying this. Oh! Oh, that? Oh, wow. Oh, no. <gasps> Holy shit. All right, that's enough, Grizzly. <laughs> I gotcha. That was an illegal move. <laughs> All right, who has a bag? Yeah, I got one. Move back. Holy shit. Fair fight, fair fight, I'm afraid. Good scrapping, though. What was they fighting over? And he just walks away. Never to be seen again. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Where's any fast start on? Don't do, don't do that. Stuck. I'm stuck. Mm. Ugh. So we need to find out that guy's name now. <laughs> what the fuck? That was that preacher. <laughs> So I let him come back to engineer. He said he was sorry. Now what the fuck happened? Oh, uh, just a friendly, just friendly, friendly scrapping. Friendly, the premier, scrapping. the premier groaner of the West showed up on this very here train. Legend has it you can hear him groaning. You know, armadillo all the way from tumbleweed. He's like a. Yodel. Coming back. Shh, 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 shh. Mm. <laughs> 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 he did it. Mm. Oh, he... mm. I was just getting back on the train. He was just back. pulling into the side of the train. I let him back on. I told you, crazy son of a bitch. Paying attention. Sold off. Oh, I didn't know where he was crying. Right, I didn't hear the, the engine so goddamn loud. <laughs> I can't believe he did it again. He did it again. Right oh, after we were talking about it, he I, came I over, and the first thing he did was. <sighs> this job for a long time. This engine is mighty loud. I'm going deaf right now. <sighs> I, th I think we need to fucking. I think we need to fucking recruit this guy right here. You see this? Imagine we just sent them, send them fronting on our enemies. We just sit there. I don't know if I want the premier grunter of the West. They'll be sitting there smoking their cigarette. All of a sudden, from right behind them, all the. This gonna... man's destined for different things. <laughs> sure, by chance, what is your name? Man leather. You talking to me? All right, we're heading back yeah, up sure there, Armadillo. Uh, if you want to hop off there, you oh. can. If not, uh, we'll continue to uh, McFarland's Lance with these. Even his name has a grunt in it. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Dom. Dom. What career might you be in, Hummus? You just call him Hummus. He did. That is his name? No, he said his name was Dom. I think that... 
Dick Sproul is at. Mr. Man. Where are they doing? This time on the train. I said Jack Spruill's asking. You law? No, I ain't law. I look law. I'm just like you. <laughs> well. Fair enough. Said you're from the swamps. Lemoyne. <laughs> How much is from Lemoyne? You get a frog stuck in your throat in the in the bayou. No, but I eat one. You ate one. Just one. I heard frog legs were very tasty. You know a certain rude boy, Rudy? Is everyone good over here? Yeah, I'm just peachy. Hey, train just making some irregular movements, just double checking on that head anchor number. What do you do around here, Tom? What's a uh, man from the bayou doing out west? I got lost. Some girl named Lucia was showing me around. It was Chi. Got lost for me. How'd you get on the train? I followed somebody here. Heading back to the swamps when you get off. Is that a yes or a no? Yes. Appreciate it, Mr. Conductor. Thing. Yep. Head north. Uh. Say what? Did I head north? Run. Mm. Oh. I, I asked him if he was going to the swamp and he said, mm. Now I have to fight him again at some point. Look, I like that guy, man. Up. Isn't there honor in taking a defeat? No. Shit. There's no honor in defeat. No, we can never lose. There's no honor in that. <laughs> See you later, Mr. Tom. Headache with the... Mm.
fuck we're waiting for? Rude boy. Rudy. Finally sent me a fucking telegram and now we got two folk in town. They just slowly trotting by the fucking sheriff's office. Shut up. <laughs> That's what we're gonna start doing, James. We strike fear into our enemies. My favorite part is when I was saying that he was the premier, premier groaner of the West. And he, he walked back up. over. <laughs> And the first thing he does is... <clears throat> Damn. Sorry, his name is Hummus. <laughs> it's Thomas, motherfucker. I don't know where he got Hummus from. He said Hummus. He said Thomas, I heard the T. He said Hummus. Thomas, I swear. I double checked. I said back to him, Hummus. He said Hummus. <laughs> There ain't no way his name is Hummus. I do not like Hummus. <laughs> no. Yes. <laughs> Look, man, we need to we need to recruit that guy. Oh, he's from the swamps. I hate the swamps. I so. <laughs> Next time I do him with a sword. See how well he fares then. Probably fair. His first words. We were asking him if he was Marvadillo. He's like, No, but I'm about to kick your ass. <laughs> why did he? Why did he say that? I think somebody asked him if he's that fellow from Marvadillo. He's like, No, but I'm the fellow that's gonna kick your ass. He's just badass. I wonder if he had two loving parents, it would make it very funny. <laughs> I don't worry about him, you win some, you lose some. No. It does sound like a Johnny yeah, sentence. Uh, that I will. Yeah, minus PP points. I like these shaders, man. I like them. I like them a lot. Uh, shaders. Kelly Chris Cross. Jesus fucking Christ. Shot that fella's head clean off, you see that? 
I still got it. Now I did it. I saw. I watched my bullet leave my gun and shoot him. Now nope, that was me. That was all me. See that? One movement. Bang. Oh, give this man a prayer. I didn't mean to kill him. I don't know why he started shooting at me. <laughs> Fuck's sake, you need to go fix yourself. No, you fix you fuck. You go fix your fucking self. Oh! Socks. Need to clean that thing. Jesus, I heard that from here. <laughs> I don't know why, but I like the sound of a dirty gun. I don't. Hate it. I don't know how this thing got so fucked. Got gun oil. Yeah, I do here. How many do you think you need? Four, five, maybe. Let's get this wagon in the swamp. Hot. Just leave it, preacher. Just leave it. Let's get the fuck out of here. Now ah, we're gonna go bury him, actually. Oh, you wanna go bury him? Yep. Poor oh, man, hide him somewhere. Hey, 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 hey. No, what are you doing? That desecrate the court. What the? Fucking heathen. <laughs> Just put him on my horse. <gasps> Throw him in the bayou, he'll sink into it. From ashes to ashes, dust to dust. Oh, Lord. I'm gonna stop by the stable, stay here. Be gone shortly. <laughs> He's stuck. <laughs> it was awkward. goes all his loves all his dreams joining the rest of the scum in the water Some local who tried to shoot shoot us.
Bro, these shaders are so good, man. How the fuck are they behind us, you dumbass? Apparently, uh, they cannot follow us across an open plane. <laughs> right for the Kinley gang. Yeah. Hey, you see how fast it is? People saying I'm, people saying I'm getting old and slow. You know, when Black Sky tried to gun me down in Valentine, one, he forgot his gun wasn't loaded, but even then, two bullets, one for his horse's head and one for him. <laughs> Listen, I'm the fastest gun in the north. Shut up. Listen, man, you're old, alright? You're older than me. You ain't even got fucking hair. Thanks, bin boy. She got a warm coat, right? I do. Let me see it. What kind of warm? Both warm. I actually have two. Yeah, we need to get you some fur. <clears throat> I got this though. I kill a bear or something. I have a coat. This is my coat. Got a little fur in it. Cool. Are we headed back home? Uh. Yeah, we're heading to Can Lake. That's where Rudy is, apparently. Pretty well. Clown, thanks for the follow.
scared the horses. I see. Could be the stream. Sometimes it, it gets jumpy sometimes. Yeah, I'll clean- I'll install something to clean my files today, guys. I'll do that. I'll, I'll, I'll watch up a video how to clean PC files. PC cleanup tutorial. I fucking like this song, man. I'm gonna put a shirt on. Take this sweater off. Pull out the brother line already. Three days, man. Three days. Already breaking out the family. Part of me feels like I'm riding with them again. She's really good, man. Yeah, I'd do that, Dan Django, but my computer is so weird with storage, bro. I'll delete shit and then it'll just it'll still say it's full. I think it might be a virus. Like I'm fairly certain I do have a virus and I've had one for a while. Yes, get off your horse and go check the fucking saloon. What the fuck's he doing? Does this look like fucking Can Lake? Preacher said he's gonna meet us there, he's gonna food. Can't even have. Okay, yours is worse than mine, dude. Holy shit. I've got GTA, Red Dead, and what's my other big game I got installed? Crusader Kings and Banner Lord, so. I got a few decently sized games, but if I want to install any I think I've got a space for more too, actually. Right, fucking fog again. Curse of the fucking snow fog. Yeah, what a lovely place. Take it easy. Oh, we're on ice, I think we're here. No, I don't have an SSD. Anyone 
anybody here? I was fucking coming. I love the sounds of the lantern. The lantern. The shader ain't that good in the snow, man. Unless I turn the thing off, right? And then it looks really nice. But if I turn that off, I get the error message. I love the, the music that plays when you're on the ice. The little do 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 do. I can't do it, that sounds like Jaws, but it's not like that. You know what I mean? I think, maybe, probably not. Perhaps. Do I read chat? No, I don't. I can't read. Chase down my full loot, land out free, on our way now. Wallace Station. 12 a.m., when was that? How long ago was 12? Team speak! <sighs> Team speak. Okay, they're on their way. They got chased by 14 law, apparently. 14 of them. 14 of them. Where's Breacher? What are you doing, Fox Man? How you doing? You seen Drew Peters around here? I think so. Fuck's that strange fella. He looks kinda cool. How you doing fella? Howdy James, how are you? Do I know you? We met in Sisica a long time ago. Name? Jameson. Ward. Jameson Ward? Mm-hmm. It's been a long time ago. Seeing as I don't remember. It was, uh, it was the night that you were getting beat up by a poltergeist. Oh. Uh, February. Yes. Yes, it ain't too long ago. This is good. That was February. Mm-hmm. This fuck. Yep. I also met you, uh, Miss Adders there as well. Howdy. Howdy. What are you doing up here? I live up here. I, well, I live in the frontier. Is that right? By yourself? No. Uh, my family lives up here. We've lived up here since uh, culture started getting revitalized back in. 
That's good to know. Yeah, we originally moved up here as well. Whereabouts in the frontier, if you don't mind me asking? Um, just once you pass out, out of Spider Gorge, you know the, uh, there's a camp that overlooks a hill. Well, not overlooks a hill. There's a there's a mountain and there's a yeah yeah I know that place. Right on the edge. Yeah, that's where we've been staying since February. What do you do? You just hunt and survive? Uh, now we used to rob banks and stuff. Let's see. We well, got the right idea living up here. Tell you the rest of the crossing's going to shit. It is very nice up here. I enjoy it. It's good to see more people up here as well. Uh, a couple months back, the most people that we would see up here is uh, Del Lobos came up here and stayed for a little bit, but then they ended up in a massive shootout, they brought a Gatlin gun up here and tore fucking culture to pieces. I think I heard of that. Well, I'm gonna meet in the get to, but I'm sure we'll be seeing each other. I might bump into you up there at the front there. We tend to uh, stay at the east of it. Y'all stay safe. Me too. Interesting. You know, James, now that we live up here, I'm gonna start telling people to stay frosty. That's your day. It's almost as bad as stay dangerous. That's worse than stay dangerous. I think it's worse. <laughs> I like the Sorry, cut of that fella's that. jib. <laughs> Who do you say you rides with, by the way? I missed that part. His family. The Jamesons or something, I don't fucking know. Apparently they live in that town, that real uh, romantic hill. Romantic hill? Ah, uh, you can see the whole crossing from up there. Oh, is that the one where we came across a uh, vermin? No, if you ever, if you were exactly, you know, you know, they were in the tent, and yes, right, right, right. I don't blame them because it's real dangerous up there. Camp's not here the, right before we came. I don't know, I didn't make it up this far, I got lost in the fog. Say. I said, is it just me or these camps not here when we just got here before? Oh, they were definitely here. What the fuck you're talking about? Yeah, I don't know. Well, we're here. Yeah, he was on his way from Wallace Station. He said 14 lawmen chased him. Who wants a whiskey? Fourteen. Oh, I'll whiskey. take. I'll take a whiskey. I'm pop open the bottle. There we go. Oh. <laughs> Here, a fucking. Up. Is that a fucking cork in your whiskey? Where the fuck it's you good. find that? <laughs> what kind of this whiskey is, fine is that? Uh oh. It's so fine, it's men go violent for it, just like that. Get that from Saint Denis. I've been drinking again, so I yeah. Uh, Oh, nice to have. I can tell you've been drinking again. I'm going to be outside for a minute. I'll be back. So, uh, what's your name? I don't believe we've met. Swain. Swain. Good to meet you. Call me Ice. Ice. We met uh, briefly, but it's been a while. Really? Oh, there's a cork yeah. in this one, too. <laughs> I was told your name. I don't know if we got properly introduced. Thank you, Fletcher. Yo. But nice yeah. to meet you. Yeah, good to meet also, you. Also, what whiskey doesn't have a cork? 
Damn what, you can't. can't you buy to buy in a glass? Well, I didn't bring a, a fucking glass on the ride over. <laughs> I brought a bottle I could anyway. pour into a glass. You want one? Sure. I yeah. love a good whiskey. Howdy, motherfuckers. Can you switch my shoulder? Yeah, can you switch your shoulder? Yeah, come in. We had about 14 so deputies chase our fucking ass deal. from Annisburg. Had to take a few more. No, I already cleaned it myself. I just couldn't reach around to stitch it. How y'all doing? Good, good. That old Cody boy I heard. I'm over here. Hot. Hot. Pick up the bear you're wearing. Hold on. There you go. So who, who else we got here? We got Preacher. Who this? Oh, his, his name is Preacher. He, he ain't. He ain't. He ain't no. He ain't no Preacher. Man, don't even man, look at this old. Look at this old start, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. You, look, you, look, you, look, you look like you give me gifts and Christmas. Oh, 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 motherfucker. <laughs> Sounds about right. Come on, everyone, to get inside. We'll we'll cozy around the fire. We'll play. We'll tango. Preacher looks cold. Preacher, can I get up in there? Get that coat, Preacher. Not that much room. There's a feller up here you can buy him from. Kills bears. How the fuck are we skin our own bears? What you playing it with? I need me a jacket, bear. Amber Duana, whatever the hell is in the bag. When we kill bears, we butcher the pal. No, no, this fella does it right. It's on my fucking. Yeah. It's on my shoulder. How y'all been? Good. You know what? Yeah. Hope you write it in. This way, y'all at now? Y'all finally made the change. All right, your name in it. We've been staying at the ranch. I used to call them. We found a fort up in the frontier. It's yeah, perfect. I heard, I I heard about that. How to do it? I remember Kev telling us about it, folks. No, don't, don't, don't. don't. What about you and yours? You you staying up here as well? Uh, I don't know. We're getting a bit too cold over here. I don't know if you guys are going to be Fucking freezing. And, um, as of yet, we still got to see what the quills are going to say. Now, we just gunned them down earlier today. Thank you. And we left mm -hmm. it at that. If they want to carry it on, and so be it. We got some business down in the West End. If not, We'll see what the next move is. But it's completely on zip. It's whether he wants to carry this on or not. It's his burden. But that day, one of his own done left him. She said she had enough. She was done. It was a sad sight right there. Real sad. Should have seen out a tear in my fucking eye. I might take another swig of that. I didn't know how it was supposed to be. It is what it is. They got a light. There's somebody outside. On top of the goddamn outhouse. Might be a roachy. It's a roachy. Look, yeah, he's fine. He's he's harmless if you don't touch me. Man, you just no, you just be James is... taking a leak, man. No, that's James's samurai. Yeah, listen, that's my Ronan. I found him. He descended from the snowy mountain tops and declared me his damio. That's my Ronan right there. Don't touch him. I'm over here. He ain't no, he ain't, he ain't no fucking pervert. He's a fucking Ronin samurai. Oh shit! I don't I don't care, pervert, man. I don't fucking care, Fuck. Man. If he's a pervert, there's gonna be little you can do he, about it. I thought he wanted to. He must like, he must like you, because as soon as he heard that word come out of your mouth, he would have thrown a shuriken at your head. You'd be dead right now. Fuck, I feel you. Maybe at my pecker while it was out right there. Shit. Cut it right off. That's right. You'd be peckerless. You'd be a damn eunuch. He's your yam yams? What'd you say? My Ronan samurai. Somebody said something about a dam around you. He calls oh, him a dam yo. The fuck does that mean? Orochi, Orochi, come down here and educate this man. Yes. He said, damn you, you damning them fella? Why you damning them? Oh, no, a dam yo. They're like the feudal. It's, it's a warlord. I'm his northern warlord. I am the northern warlord. I am. I am. I am the northern warlord. His words, king of the north. King of the north. It wasn't his words. That's fucking James' words right there. So, so Kelly, you you running this whole thing around him? Damn right. What the fuck? You have any law, bro? Have any what? 
The law come up here. Weller. Yeah, well, I mean, Weller, but I mean, he said... <coughs> he said that... If I'm not causing a trouble up there, uh, you know, I am the... I am the Northern Warlord after all. I see. Oh, he said that? No, he did exactly. Not he got down on one knee. He got one down. He got down on one knee like this and pledged his allegiance. Damn. You're talking about me. No. Duncan. Talking about Duncan. Watch Willie's and you get down on your knee. To the king in the north. The Willie Watcher. The outhouse pervert. Do not disgrace him like that. Leave All right. me. That's it. I have to move bandit. Anyway, that was saying. <laughs> Leave me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're moving bandit on. Is... Moving on. All right, the bandit, ba bathroom bandit is crazy. I just gotta say. Just leave and stop. <laughs> move on. Anyways, we went into Annisburg. Met a few folk there. And out of nowhere, 14 law dogs come chasing after us, fellas. Put a few of them down, but we we kept riding like the fucking wind. We was out of there. Forty. We, if you, we, motherfucker, we looked back and it was just a wave of fucking uh, law dogs coming at us, just climbing each other, just they are fucking hungry to grab us. Every time I look back, they just multiplied, and this is after a whole fucking shootout at the fort. Yeah. Yep. You know, if it wasn't for that yeah. fucking rope round your waist, you'd look real. Nice in that outfit. I was thinking about making one like that. This one, this one keeps me humble right here with the, with the rope right here. It reminds me of the humble beginners. No, I like, I, like, I like how this coat looks when it's wet. I make it black. Hold my on, diet. Geez. I don't, I don't want to, I don't want to ever hear you say that ever again. I like a Talk lot of about things it. wet as well. Mm -hmm. Talk about mm -hmm. Especially, especially out here in this harsh, harsh environment. Because this fella to my right is giving me that. What? Okay, that's enough. That's <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Listen. Right, right, right. Leave, leave okay. a Roger alone. He, <laughs> he will cleave your head from your shoulders. Okay, calm down, fella. <laughs> if my master wishes it. <laughs> you wish it, fella? You wish it? What? You wish it? What if he does? Man, look at him. He got a five o'clock yeah, shadow now. Look at him. Who, me? Is that what you call us? Is that what you call stubble? Yeah. Yep. The fuck this five o'clock sh Now that sounds like a bathroom bandit. Five o'clock right. shadow. Five o'clock shadow is the proper thing. And hey, watch out! You don't go, don't go into the, don't go, don't, don't go, don't go into the fucking Valentine bathhouse after dark because the five o'clock shadow will be working, waiting for you. He'll be hot. That's what that sounds like. Okay, that's that's his new nickname. Am I right? I know how that, uh, <laughs> I know how the bath water anyway, gets all dirty. Anyways, anyways, anyways. Look. What about you? What have been your plans now that you've settled over here? You know, after that day, are you going to do anything about it? Oh, shit. Something's already been done. They've had a few offers from folk. Want to open up trade routes up here for fur and ice and the like. I might do that. But like you said before, I got some things to handle down west. That don't mean I'm staying down there. We'll descend from the snow when we need to. Do real warfare, like you did earlier. Do real warfare, baby. Cause there's some goals down there that need to be taught a lesson and given a reminder, same as the bastards and thieves. Heard about that. We picked up uh, Raul yesterday. I was gonna let him go, but Freaks has been on that whiskey again, and he's real violent. <laughs> he would have shot us anyway. We didn't do it now. Would have been his gun later. Who's Man's who? guarding the golds. He said it himself. Who's that fella to your right, Breaches? We died with think... him. We gave him his wish. I don't think we met before. Swain. Swain. Robot Rudy. Pleasure, fella. Pleasure. How you meet him, James? Josie. I haven't even had a conversation oh. with him yet, to be quite frank with you. Oh. Oh, you Met him quite a bit ago. He uh, rode with Cass and uh, things were a little quiet out west. He's good people. I see, I see. Mama you, Josie. Okay. You, see, 
You see Please don't what, call me mom. You, you, see, what to, you see what happened to... Stop it, Jay. You see what happened to Armadillo. Man, shut the fuck up, man. You, see what, I, you know what, man? Fuck yeah. Armadillo. Man, Armadillo can suck my dick. You know, speaking of Armadillo, we hopped on a train over in Armadillo and we ran into the premier groaner of the West, fella. You can hear this motherfucker. It sounds like his tummy is rumbling, brother. Oh, you can hear this fella. You can hear this fella's fucking tummy grumble from all the way armadillo to tumbleweed, fella. Mm. Oh, to kick your ass. Mm. Oh, we asked him, you know, because he appeared like some kind of fucking vengeful spirit on the train. It was a runaway train. There was a lot of fucky shit going on there. And we thought, you know, he's fell, he's fallen off, we won't see that fella again, he's probably dead. Anyway, five minutes, ten minutes later, we turn around and he's standing there again, all ominous. So one of us asked him something, I forget what it was, what's his name or something, where he's gone, where he's from. No, we thought he was the vampire from fucking Armadillo, the vampire hunter. Don't fucking derail my story again. And then someone asked him a question, and this fella goes, No, but I'm the fella who's gonna kick your ass. Oh, to Orochi shit, right there. So I tell Orochi he ought to go fucking sort him out, you know, smack him a little bit. Left, right, good nights. T send his ass to fucking bed. Orochi goes up behind him and tries to grab him. Uh, you know, slips off and they start fighting. Anyway. I'll add the sound effects. Moral of okay. the story is this fella don't speak. He, he speaks and, and grumbles. And as he fought, all you could hear. <clears throat> oh, oh. <sighs> Order, order, order. We asked him where he's going. I uh, shit you not, he said, mm. <laughs> 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 And I said, fella, does that mean yes or no? And he said, yes. That's what he said. He said he's from Lemoyne. He's from Lemoyne. He's a Bayou Bandit. I asked him. I asked him if you're from the swamps, fella. You ought to be. If you're from the swamps, fella, you you definitely been swallowing frogs. Who the fuck is this? Maybe Senor Yezzy. Maybe Senor Yezzy. Ah. What you got your gun out for? Oh shit! Yes. What is on the back of your wood? Oh, oh Jesse. I had a Jesse. Man, Jesse, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Bye, Joseph. Uh, <laughs> Jesse, I got put on the ass. Uh, How you doing, bud? I'm sorry, but I'm on the train. I'm good. It's good to see you. Good to see you, too. It's been a while. Fucking ass, everybody. Where's Rami? Where is Rami? I thought he was there. Yeah, where is Rami? Rami, Rami, what's up with you? Oh shit. Yeah. What? Anyone got any food for me? My tummy's about to sound like the premier yeah, grumbler of the West. I am intrigued. Whoever said something about Josie doing the impression, I am intrigued. Shut hey. 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 Oh, <laughs> You know what? You couldn't get that out of me even if you had a gun to my head. <laughs> See, just sound like you're waking up in the morning or something. Maybe we had it all wrong. Maybe that fella was constipated or something. Maybe. That's it's like when you overstretch in the morning, man. It starts cramping. Like some, <laughs> some prunes or something. I'll be cramping your leg or something. <laughs> oh, fuck, man. They're arguing about woolen coats. Between the two of their coats, man, I think about 47 fucking coats. animals died. <laughs> what the hell? I'm warm. Man, y'all look like the whole ass Sasquatch, man, just without the fucking big feet. You guys killed the At whole forest to fucking make those two coats. In. If I'm getting chased in the snow, all I gotta do is lay down. It's like a damn yeah, polar yeah. bear. They'll never find you when you get stuck in the snow. Now that vampire hunter better not come up north. He's gonna think Remy's a yeti and shoot him. I, 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 <laughs> you don't know where he's gonna hear him a mile away. Mm. I look, yeah, fair. I look amazing. All right, no, no even. No, no, no. That fella wasn't a vampire hunter. We ran into a lot of oddballs today. That was a yeah, whole entire different fella. 
Armadillo is pretty much the, the yeah. worst Valentine. No, the West, the, the, West worse than the West has fallen, fellas. The West, the West has fallen. The, the West has risen, fellas, because all of these wars. That's right. That's where it's risen. It's fallen, Armadillo. Armadillo is falling. The West is risen. Just doing this Muppet shit out here. Cut this shit out. Who the fuck did this? <laughs> Damn! Oh, it's okay. Damn, how the fuck? I'm on that super soldier serum. Alright, you just gonna fucking my toe on my, my fingers down. And what were we talking about before we got derailed? Swain as well, wherever Swain is. Who would have thought right Swain? What are you thinking about? Some Bayou boys up in the snow. Yeah, right. Not my not my preferred place. Man, what you talking about? The Bayou? Yep. Yep. You said yeah. the Bayou ain't your preferred place? No, I know. It is. It is. Who would have thought oh, us, us Bayou boys being up here? Damn. <laughs> you get all man. offended. God damn, brother. Man, <laughs> listen. Don't, don't disrespect the Bayou, man. And the fucking, sw the, the fucking snow is ten times better than the fucking stinky, smelly, muddy no, Bayou. Listen, man, you said what? What you say? I fucking hate, I fucking, I fucking hate gators and crawfish. Mr. Kelly, where are you from? Where am I from? Yeah. Australia. Yeah, me too. I'm not, Ain't no swamps yeah. in Australia. That is hell on earth. Swamps are swamps are banned over there. Bro, I'm gonna I'm gonna go to bed. I had a talk with somebody. I pray um, I think uh, her name is yeah Harriet, and she was telling me all the bad things about that place. Ain't no good food. What the fuck yeah, would Harry know about Australia? Flying cockroaches. Um, a bunch of yeah, I, uh, just nasty things Damn, around. She's just disrespecting Australia like this. What would she? What would she know about Australia? I don't Ain't she from Van Horn? Van Hornian. Van, Van Horny. Horny is the correct one for Van Horny as well. The women are the horny, and the men are the hornian. By the By the way, do we have the same color? You no. Know, it, what, what, what did we come up here to discuss, by the way? What you want to be? What you want to be about, bro? I've been trying to meet with you for two weeks, but you fucking off. I got you were illiterate and you can't read. Yeah, man, no, I, I, I learned how to read and write. Yeah, well, you know, it's not they who. Well, you, well, you, ain't, you ain't putting, you ain't putting them fucking, yeah, you ain't putting them skills a good use. Well, I mean, look, fella, all I know is how to write out with, and I say I know how to write much. Did you get beat up recently? Oh, never mind. Sorry, the light was glistening off your face. Oh, Lord. I thought. Yeah, I wonder where you learned that from. <laughs> I can think of a place too. It's not out west anymore. It's up north. Uh, it's up north now, bro. Yeah, yeah north. be damned. You better open that book again. Oh, and even and even up north, it's gone down to one word: ranch. Period. Alright, though. What you want to mean about though? What was it? I don't know about about you. Uh, Turn around. What are you talking about? Talking in the back of your head now. No, you ain't. Okay, okay, well. I'm looking due northwest right now. Oh, what are, what are, you know I can you know how I can tell. I can you too. Because the sun's over that way. Oh wow. I, I can't even see this sun. I can't even I was about to say I can't even see that shit. Exactly. Are you, are you saying though? Well, I wanted to, I wanted to get a grasp of what you were doing now, cause you told me at that campfire meeting with Jack that uh, you know the frontier was the future. Some yeah, bad outlaws cool. dying, and the West ain't the same anymore. And I thought you didn't know the first thing about what you're talking about. What? I thought on a little bit, looked around my surroundings, and. You were right. Nothing but a bunch of Muppets over in Thieves Landing and the rest of them are all fucking... Doing God knows what. We got the goals out here ratting on folk. Nobody wanted to listen to me when I said they weren't cut out for this life. Ratting, huh? What'd they say? What'd they say to the law? 
Anyone know more about this than me? I guess that is Wallaby's word, so take it with a grain of salt. Those were his words. Yeah, I haven't heard nothing about them ran to the law. Hard to say if it was him who read it, considering there are other people that showed up when we uh, took Richie. Yeah. Well, anyway, even if they didn't... Something off about them, I never liked them. Gun down mills, I'm sure you heard about that. Yeah, dude. Do we know why they're getting involved? The golds? <laughs> Just cause? Just cause, that's right. Hit the nail on the fucking head. Oh, fuck you. Look. And they hit a nail on their fucking head. You gotta do what you gotta do. See, right now all I'm seeing is the West is turning into a, a brawl. Old outlaws versus new outlaws. That's what it's looked like. The West is changing, times are changing. Ever since Armadillo starting to get rebuilt, everything started to shift politically. Folk are realizing it's either time to adapt or stick true to your nature. And that's not beating around the bush, those that adapt, well, they gonna outlive those that are standing by their uh, they principles, their tradition. Or a dying fucking breed. Ain't not much of us left. A lot of folk now act like Easterners. Because they are Easterners. They come down here, they shift like snakes to the climate. Whatever suits them best. So long as they live to tell the tale. I ain't gonna knock it, it's smart. But that ain't me, that ain't you. That ain't nobody here. Rudy looks so badass, man. Look at Rudy, dude. We don't dude. want that for nobody. Rudy looks gangster. You know, look at me, I will never take a role a day in my life. I refuse. I'm not gonna bend the knee to no law, dog. Ever. Fuck him and fuck the parole. That's like a reach, leash around your fucking neck. You know, it's practically walking you around. That's the only way they can't control you. And I've been saying this all day. All day. We're all chasing that little freedom. That's why y'all up here. And boy, freedom is one ugly bitch. We got the Marston hat. We got Ain't the Marston really pants, want. brother. The only reason everybody after is because nobody can truly have her. That's why she's so valuable. This right here, this is close as freedom could get right now. Up here, up north. But it comes at a price, sacrifice, a lot of death, a lot of frostbite too. But eventually, I'm sure everybody here knows too, this place is going to end up like the West. It's only a matter of time. Let's just hope that the next generation got to deal with that. You know, the Marston vest would actually Not look us. real good with the outfit right now. But unfortunately, James, it looks like after y'all gone, me and mine, our generation, we're going to have to deal with this. And we're going to be the ones that are put to death at the end of the age of the outlaws. Because it's looking like every fucking breed is coming after us are corrupted by these Eastern ideals and principles. Where they'll chuck their brother to the fucking wolves just so they can breathe for an extra second, an extra minute. So greedy. This is what the West has become. What the East always used to be. And give it a bit of time what the North is going to be. 
But I see what you're doing here. I see you fucking standing your ground. Because that's all fucking ideals. And let me tell you something, James. You gonna hold it the fuck down over here. Make it a safe haven. For the outlaws that used to call the West home. But now walk into that door and don't know where the fuck they at and can't recognize the place at all. If you ever need fucking assistance, me and my boys are gonna be right there for you. Cause I'll be damned if what's left of the real outlaws sit by and idly watch us get destroyed. We either all go down together or we die separately and I ain't going for the latter. I learned a lot from you. I learned a lot from Jack as well. Short time that I know him. My boys as well. So I truly believe whatever ideals and principles y'all built up for yourselves in those years, they lived through us. Nobody else. I haven't seen a single soul with the same fucking ideals and principles. Not a single fucking soul. Y'all stand by that ground. Y'all and us are what's left. And we're dying. Terribly. We're gonna be put to death. I hope y'all realize none of us is coming out of this thing. Dying on no fucking bed. That's a fucking dream and a half. That you'll never be able to achieve. You can wish anything. Money beyond your fucking imagination. Fucking good health or whatever. But shit, that ain't, that ain't, all that is not going to fucking stand. Because so long as you're in this life, you're dying terribly. You're going to get gunned the fuck down like the dog you are. And good, fuck it, we are dogs. You know something I notice? Everybody, everybody that ever gets called a dog, they somehow get pissed off. Uh, I'm, I got a dog in me. I'm that dog. That's good. If I gotta die like a dog, so be it. But guess what? At least the dog is fucking low. Ferocious. I ain't gonna bite your neck. All these law dogs that are coming through, they ain't reading the signs. They're stepping right into that lawn and they about to get their necks bit. All of them. This lawn right here that we standing on. We not might not be able to live here. And you know, my boys, I was gonna complain about the cold. And honestly, the frostbite is killing me too. I don't know about living up here. We'll see as time goes by. But for now, we're making them regular trips over here. Even more than out west. But yeah, y'all gonna be seeing our faces around here. I don't know if we're settling. But I do hope that at some point, y'all show us around in the uh, frontier. I want to know the whole place. I want to realize what the layout looking like. The lay of the land. So if we ever do go up here, we know where to go. That'd be a real big help. I'm gonna ask you something, Rudy. Go ahead. Remember when, uh, speaking of golds, will be gold sent you after me. Wanted to do me. You found me an armadillo. Yeah, I remember. How can I forget? Remember what you told me? Remind me. You told me that all the stories you heard about outlaws were all bullshit. We're all Muppets. You wanted to be a real one. You wanted to have your name in books. Be a legend. Quick draw. Pass this gun. Tell me, Rudy, how do you feel that's going? Think you achieved that? Yeah. 
I'm always the one. No, it's no longer just rude boy Rudy. It's the rude boys. No, my name lives on, not just through me and my actions, but through the actions of my brothers. Now together we're all becoming legends. <coughs> Every last single one of us. I'm so grateful that I met all of them. These here, my family. They're both my strengths and my weakness. I set out to become the greatest gun singer ever. I reckon I achieved it. On the way over. But on top of that, I found similar motherfuckers. I thought that I was leading a life for myself, but honestly, I achieved something far greater. I've gathered what's left of this generation's principles and idealistic real outlaws. Slap that rude boy name on him. Called him brother. And now we stand tall for the fear in both deputies, outlaws, and townie hearts. Not a soul wants to fuck with us. They don't. Even Zip don't want to fuck with us. It's unfortunate that he had to eat those bullets. But this just how the ways go, honestly. If you uh, achieved... But you said I had to achieve what's left. A new mission, a new goal. The new mission has been the same one the whole time. There's always ways to make a, our legacy bigger. Well, no, I ain't done yet. However, at this current point in time, I'm focusing on culling all the weak. The ones that are going to bring about the destruction of the outlaws sooner rather than later. Once those weak are called away, the strong will hold against the law. The unwavering onslaught of the law. I'm looking forward to that day. If you want to talk about legacy, down right there, that's a permanent mark. After you, that's what I want. After you count the wake, front wall, what's your goal there? What do you want to achieve? I don't know yet after that. Like I said, the main goal has always been about legacy, about living forever, but not physically. Only by name. So you don't want to change nothing? You just want to follow them until you die? What is there to change, James? Other than what we can control, I could change who calls themselves fucking outlaws by putting a bullet in them. That's about it. What powers do we possess? When it comes to the law, there's nothing we can change by shooting them, gunning them down, killing any of them. The only thing that'll change is what happens when they kill us. Any change we can bring, around, bring about in terms of the law is dying. Hope you don't have any uh, false ideas or false senses when it comes to the law. The hell bent on this mission. You sound like you got a proposal for me. Uh, not really. 
on your proposal, I'd go for you is to stand true, make sure you're doing what you really want to do, make sure you think hard about it, what's going to happen when you pursue these goals, what's going to happen to not only you, but your folk here, and the folk that care for you. That's the thing, Jay. That's the life we live. Every last single rude boy here understands it. Because I tell them time and time again. This life is going to end one way and one way only. We're all going to get tragic deaths. Amen. None of us coming out of this alive. We know. Mm. Well, that ain't the truth though, is it? It is, James. The See, folk, accepted, the better. folk say that. As if there's something good about it. As if it's inevitable, it's impossible, but it ain't. It really ain't. Real simple. If any one of us truly didn't want that, we'd put down our guns, take all the money we've got, and leave. So why ain't you done that yet? I'll tell you why. I know why. It's because you can't change who you are. None of us can. We're made for this life. It's all we fucking know. Every last single soul around us over here came from lint thicky pockets. We ain't have shit. Poor broke bastards. Sick and tired. You know, uh, you know, I semi right. Maybe I couldn't change who I was. But a fella very similar to you, not with mindset, but status. Relation to me could. Yeah, you know, I shot a man today. Self defense. And it was a very budget, very small and inconsiderate, but we held a funeral for him. <laughs> May I have changed. Because people can change. This life will change you for better or for worse. Humans are moldable at their core. Adaptable. Ever read those books I got in those fancy libraries in Saint Denis? I read the ones of Sissica. Boone used to have a lot of books. Ones he stole, ones he wrote. Thing called Evolution. There you go with that adapted talk. Right now, the only way to adapt is only one way and one way over. You bend over. That's it. That's true adapting to your the, the surroundings. Because everything's becoming society all around you. Cities, towns, goddamn governments and all that shit. It's going all around you. What does that mean? That means that you need to become integrated into society. What does that mean? That means there's no room for outlaws. Because us outlaws, we don't believe in no society. We believe in freedom. And we get to do whatever the fuck we want. There is no room for That's right. society. That's right. It's a belief. It's in our mind. It's a state of mind. Gunning hey, folk down, robbing banks, robbing trains that'll make you an outlaw. Not a... Not living... By the government's laws and their codes and their regulations and the text they write in fancy mansions, that's been an outlaw. And Rudy, you are correct. They are turning these places into cities. Armadillo will be the new Blackwater. All the camps around Armadillo will be just like how it was not two months ago. 
They will continue to do this. They will continue to civilize this world and we will still be here. When they come up to Coulter and they start paving the damn roads, I'll move further north into the frontier. And when they come knocking, I'll move further north. If I have to, I'll fucking find a boat and I'll sail to a damn island. Because we have that choice. We have the choice to adapt, to move on. There's always a damn choice. Yeah, there is a choice. You're right. Those is a choice. Hey, everything you do. But what type of man would you be if you don't stand over for what you believe in? If you don't die by those fucking ideas? Huh? What type of man would you be? How would they remember you? Because I'll be damned if the last thing they remember about me is Rudy went ahead and said, fuck this and scram. I don't, uh, I don't frankly care what they write or think about me. Never have. Well, I did. It's a lie. Now I don't. They can say what they want. All the folk in the West are calling me a cow with a shooting a man in the back. You know what I say to that? Fuck you, I don't give a shit. Go fuck yourself. Shoot you in the damn back too. They'll remember me as a man who cared for his people. The folk that matter will. Didn't want to see another from, another one of them dead. The hands of the law or another gang. Anything. This all we fucking know. All we fucking know. If we ever go and get integrated in society in any capacity, this we'll never be able to forget this. But that's why I say we cannot change. Folk, people cannot change at their core. No, they cannot. We're not tangible like that. You learn from your experiences, and yes, you said as you said, you're dead. But you're always still the same person. I look at law dogs, fella. They used to be criminals in their fucking past. They still got the same ideals, but just with a badge now. That's it. But they pretend like they changed, but they have it. Not one bit, not a lick. Because they're still the same person. You cannot change who the fuck you are. You stay that same person. It could change in your younger years, but once you're older, it's, it's you just become a muscle memory to you. This is who you are. This is you as a person. It's how people know you as. You could pretend like you changed, but you never truly. You still get those fucking urges. You're still the same fucking person, no matter who the fuck you are, where the fuck you are. So what? The two options I see is you suppress who the fuck you are and lose that freedom over yourself or you take that freedom enjoy what you have of it and be it by the end of it you understand that everything in life is give or take you sacrifice everything, but you get the taste of some that nobody truly owns. Freedom, the most valuable thing in the world. Now you can say that, Rudy. You can say you're free, but yet you're locked in this state of mind. You're imprisoned by it. Your mind don't sound very free right now, Rudy. That's what you think. Sounds like you have a different ideal, brother, but that, uh, that's not me. No. I'm free as I've ever been. This is me thinking this way. Because I'm free from the fucking thoughts of worrying about what comes next instead of living for the day. We got chased down by 14 deputies. You know, any same person would be like, man, fuck, we're going to get caught. They're going to gun us down there. We gonna die. Man, we was laughing on our way over here. That's not just physical freedom. That's freedom of the soul. Ain't got no worries about tomorrow. He stopped worrying about tomorrow. He stopped enjoying the present, fella. 
That's all you truly have, because you never throwing how many futures you got. What you're starting is about is what present you do have. Right now, I got the best present of all. I got my brothers with me at all times. Shit. If the present that we're living right now ends with us being six feet under, so be it. But I'm down with my brothers. Yeah, what happens when they start dropping like flies? What happens if they kill all of them and you're the last one left? What then? Well, fella, there is no surviving this. So one way or another, they pound to put a bullet in me. I'm gonna keep fighting. As a matter of fact, they put down my brothers and I'm the last one standing. I'm gonna go 10 times harder. Till they fucking kill me. I'll never die. You think the lawmen are gonna parade your body around and say, look, this is Rudy. He killed a lot of us, but he's a legend. He killed a lot of us, but damn, he was quick on that draw. They gonna toss me in with the rest of my brothers in a ditch of an unnamed fucking grave or whatever. It don't matter. But I need you to realize that this this fountain of youth that we're chasing, it's not physical. It's not dead. Us right here, what happens to my body, I don't give a fuck. True immortality is in your name. If my name lives on forever, then I really put on a big fuck you to the whole law and everybody that ever tried to fucking stop me. Because, shit, I may be dead, but my name ain't. And that's all you is, really. Your soul is your name. That's what you assigned to on um, birth. So if my name's still alive, but there ain't nobody to host it, so be it. I'm still breathing there. My lungs ain't working, ain't moving, but I'm still breathing. My mouth ain't moving. But people still say my name. My eyes don't work, but people still see the shit that I fucking do. I could go on. I don't gotta be here. And none of us do. That's why they say your fucking actions speak louder. Because those are the ones that are gonna fucking echo. So either call into a fucking hole and say, fuck it. Whatever measly years I have in this fucking earth, I'm going to fucking live them and try to uh, live as best as I can and do whatever I'm fucking told. Or you do whatever the fuck you want because nothing is guaranteed. Your life could be shorter than mine. And if that's the case, either live those last few years in true happiness, true freedom, or you waste them all. Just wondering, oh, what's gonna happen in the year after? Or hey, let me let me just live a few years, man. Like fuck life, man. Look at this. We're all wearing raggedy ass clothes, sitting above a fucking broken down building in the fucking cold, while folk in Saint Denis are enjoying warm meals inside a warm home, with their feet kicked up. Yeah, we never got shit in life. No, we, look, we, we was never given none. This is the hand that we fucking dealt. But you play with the cards that you have. You don't try stealing from another dick. Because when you do, it ends up worse than you think. Now, fuck it. I got my hand. I'm going to make the most out of it. If I start envying whatever the people have, I ain't going to enjoy the hands, uh, the hands that I have. And I'm going to end up losing. A whole lot. Life's a fucking gamble. You ain't guaranteed success on the table at all. That's why you gotta. You have a lot more pound than you think. What you mean by that? I know I got pound. When you walked into that saloon and you told me what you wanted, I said, okay. Well, with me, I'll help you get it. Got it? You got what you wanted, what you set out to achieve. And you're gonna get what you want now. A death. Fast and glory. Your name in the history books, you'll get it. If you... 
Change your mind right now. You wanted something else, you'd get that too. That's the type of man you are, Rudy. Fuck cards, fuck decks, fuck all well, your poker analogies, because they don't make no sense. <laughs> if you wanted to change right now, you would. If you wanted a different life, you'd get it. If you wanted something different, you'd get it. What you did before, it's what you'll continue to do. And I do. If life is like a game of cards, a deck. I do envy other decks. The life of the people we call townies are simple folk. You don't gotta worry about their brothers and their sisters and their... People they care about getting gunned down and executed. Hung. Their brains scrambled like eggs. All they gotta worry about is if they got food on their tables. Their fucking niece or that dog got cholera. Their fucking fences are all mended after the harsh winter. Man, I don't want those problems. That's not the type of man I am. You know, what? we tough folk. We we born out the hardships, fella. That's all we fucking know. None in life is easy, ever. Shit, I don't want those problems at all. Give me the problems I have now because they made me a better man than any of those fucking muppets. I got better principles than them. I could survive. And I saw the deputies. I'm like, I could hold my own. Put me anywhere and I'll fucking still be standing. Man, well, better than nobody else. Their lives are still hard. Just for different reasons. Life ain't easy for nobody. Yeah, We're murderers, crazy. robbers, bad folk. Half of the folk here, they went force into this. They decided to do it. Truth for most of them. Our laws. Maybe your opinion won't change, Rudy. It did for me. You remind me a lot. Myself. Before burn, CD. Your bass, garlic. Sam. <laughs> Got about Sam. I was thinking about the Premier Groner. Maybe your opinion will change. Keep your mind open to it. Just by what you're saying now, people can change. Maybe you won't change your mind, but you'll realize that.
James, if the Lord come knocking, we going to be there. We going to always be there. Remember that. Yeah, that's what I expect of you. Don't go throwing away your life for a stupid cause. Don't pick up a gun because someone else told you to fight their battles. Unify with these folk. They don't deserve your life. Your outfit, the people who bleed for you, the people that care about you, they do. And I can respect that. Don't ever look into the eyes of one of those golds or any muppet like them. Just because they call themselves a westerner. They say they share your ideals, but they don't know the half of it. Folk like us aren't meant to be unified. Oh, we ain't. And this, uh... Folk like us are meant to be given one horrible death. You may not see it, James, but... You look like you want a new trajectory. You decided a different path. You know, me personally, I'm happy. I'm glad. Ain't nothing more than I want then for you and Josie to live on a good long life. Preacher and Ice too, everybody. That's why we fight, because if y'all don't fight, somebody got to. You might say nobody deserves that, but to me, there ain't no great honor. I had to go ahead and lay down your life for the folk that you love. That's why you gotta do it. Somebody gotta do it. If it ain't you, it gotta be me. I'll no, gladly do it. I will do that. But I ain't got to. Me dying right now would only put my folk into more harm's way. Damn them further. Go, go put my foot down ten times hard. I want you to know I'll triple and double. Yeah, and that wouldn't help you. Not one bit. I already witnessed a whole lot of folk die. It's the only life that we boys don't know. Oh, no, that's it. That's all we know. That's it. Ain't no change in this. I don't think anybody want to change this. But like I said, James, the law come knocking, we're going to be there. Just remember us on that day. Until then, don't run, don't trip. <laughs> you just tripped off the roof. <laughs> Keep your mind open, Rudy. Nothing set in stone. You know, you really had me until the whole finger gun thing. How's that fella down there gonna gun down 14 law if he can't even handle some cold? went to bed. You can go back to the ranch. Yeah, unless you want to lay your head here. They interrupted everything over there. I was practicing my dance moves in the I, snow. I, I, I saw that. Very, very good. Very majestic. Yes, so you're coming over here to say the, uh, the army rolled in with their Gatlin guns and their war dolphins. I'll stand right behind you as soon as they did that, by the way. Um, just wanted to say that it was good to see y'all. I still hate it up here, but I wouldn't, you know, it wouldn't be bad to come up here and see y'all again. You know, my mama. My papa, right here. 
Y'all retired in a really nice place here at this humble abode. Said anything about retirement. Isn't that what y'all was talking? All their metaphors. Did, did I get the whole keep, wrong thing from keep, that? Keep your mind open, Curtis. I don't know about that. It's hard to do that. I'm still learning a lot, but as long as I have my mama and you around. All right. Keep, keep your mind right. open, Curtis. All right. <laughs> hey, what's up, so. dolphin? Okay, bye. I see y'all around. Holy shit. Hopefully, I'm not dead. Bye. He said I was gonna. He said we was gonna die. Hopefully, I don't die. You'll see one day. See when you reach the uh, when when you reach the infamy of James Kelly, they bring out special things for you. Can I? Can I do just one impression before I leave? Is it is it the James? Go ahead. Keep your mind open, Keep your mind always open, mind. Because you'll turn into a pawn on the bomb, eh? All right, I'm sorry. Bye. Did you really just delay us so that you can moan at them? See you later, motherfuckers. Bye, everybody. Adios, amigo. Bye. Ah, sweet little children all grown up. <laughs> you love to see it. Disgusting creations. Yep. It is. Hopefully they come by to visit. I don't think I could bear it. Can I go to sleep now? Yeah, just don't wake up. <laughs> Why do you hate me? You're ugly. <laughs> Got some wrinkles on your forehead now. Hey! You're an ass. An absolute fucking ass. Well, you did it now. Oh god, what the fuck is this? There you go. That's your new hat right there. Well, I figure I ought to go, uh... Read a book and go to bed. Maybe read about, uh... Been reading a book about New York. Yeah, okay. Alright, I'll see you tomorrow, James. Good loop. Good night. Sleep well. Sweet dreams. Honey worm. Sunny worm. Where is Dakota? And scout. Sunny worm. Sunny worm. Uh, um. Oh god, we're in this disgusting piece of shit. <laughs> Fuck this cursed town. Where's our damn package? I shoved it up at my ass. That's where your 150 bucks went. In stocks, that's right. Sunny stock. Okay, mission today. We need to get some bonds, guys. We need to get some bonds, bank bonds, and then rename them. We're going to buy two item, item labels, or 
Yes, actually, yes, 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 yes. That right there. There we go. Bada bing, bada boom. Take your time, Sonny. There you go. Two item labels. You might as well buy five. They're cheap. We're rich. Pick up package. We're going to actually create stocks. We need to find some bank robbers. Hello. People of Armadillo. Yes. Would you like to invest in something called stocks? I can make you rich. At about twenty five dollars. Five. Sorry, partner. I don't think we have enough money to become rich in the first place. Though no. Well, that's enough, but anyway, right. one second, just one second of your time, if you gentlemen would follow me around this corner. I have a business proposal. One second. Excuse me, would you guys like to buy Shut up! Stock? Shut up! Oh, okay. Well, he's a dapper one, ain't you? Okay. Make sure you're speaking real quiet. What? I know some bad folk when I see them. And you two look like real bad, mean, angry folk. Am I correct? No. What are you talking about, Deuce? Yeah, we, we, we real bad. Real nasty. Real, real, real bad. <laughs> bad. Well, I don't see no badges on your chest. That's because we ain't deputies. That's what I like to hear. You see, me and my orphan brother here that I found in New York. Piss off, mind your own business. Me and my orphan brother here that I found in New York, we need, we need a favor. And we can pay you a lot of money. I'm sure you like money. Everybody loves money. Yeah. I got a lot of it. Look at this suit from Chicago. I'm sure it costs you a lot of money. Five hundred dollars. My lord. Hey, five hundred dollars. Five hundred. And how much yours cost? Four hundred and ninety-nine. Oh well, it seems like he got a better suit on. See, me and my... I couldn't get the one he had. Me and my orphan brother here from New York. We're, we're, we're stockbrokers. That's how we make our money. Now, this pissing shit town here, this whole state, they don't got any stocks. We're going to create our own stock. The first to ever do it. Sunny stock. Now, this, ain't, this is going to start off real small. That's how stocks work. You ain't going to make that much money. 
But let me tell you, this thing is going to take off. Innovation. Entrepreneurship. Right. So all I need Can you is... explain these sunny stocks for me a little bit? Well, it's like a rare form of currency, you see. Not like gold. Not like gold. Or cash. Or gems. Or labor. It's a piece of paper. With a fancy little artwork on it. And you're positive these things are gonna take off. I am 199% certain. Whoever invests in this stock is going to be rich. That's right, big money. But right now I'm faced with a dilemma. I don't have any paper. You don't have any paper for these stocks? No, I need some bank bonds. Bank bonds, a piece of paper from a notebook won't work. Just bank on. bonds are the only paper that'll do. They're made with specific paper. That's the paper I need. Real sturdy. I'm just gonna draw on them. Okay. And how do you plan on getting these bonds? Most folk don't have them unless these companies or banks. That's where you come in. You and your friend here. Menacing. Evil man. <laughs> yeah. Menacing and evil and robbers of bank bonds. You got that on the mark, big buddy. So what are you asking of us? You want us to get you some bank bonds? That's right. All right. Well, that ain't no easy feat now. I get you these bank bonds. I expect I'd be seeing a big payday from it. Mm-hmm, you betcha. So, don't be a ballpark figure here. That's 500 bucks sound. 500 big ones. You keep the loot, all I need is the bonds. I don't know, I was thinking a little bit more in the, uh, 1200 range. 1200? Well, I can buy a damn carriage is, with that kind of money. This is a dangerous thing you're asking us to do here. Know how many people like you there are in this desert? I can go find someone to do it for five cents. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh, shit. Kid. I'm not robbing any bank bonds for you. I ain't a bad man, and neither is my friend here. We ain't deputies, but we ain't thieves. All right. Now, if you want to make money legitimately, I'm sure you can invest and actually get you some bonds with some businessmen. Going around the desert looking for 10 buck one eyed fucking pistoliers ain't going to do you nothing but get you some trouble. Now, I can hook you up with some people that could get you some solid work. Yes, I realize I'm one eye. Yes, yes, we both are. Well, look, you don't judge a book by its cover. Just like how. No, I judge a book by how much money it can make me. <laughs> well, cover of this book says zero dollars. So you're telling me I can get my hands on some bank bonds entirely legally? Of course. Hmm. And how would I do that? Well, what are bank bonds used for? Legally. Stocks. <laughs> mm -hmm. And if you want to get your hands on some bonds, you got to trade. What? Money? Somewhat. You gotta get yourself with a crew. Contract crew. Or someone who has connection to the contract crew. 
I don't know, get you a little settlement built up. A little project. Government gives out these bank bonds. They're used to supply payroll and supplies, and you get a piece of that. So you ought to find yourself a crew. Pose as entirely legitimate and legal contractors. And get yourself on some legal state-issued bonds. To fund this great project that you may have in mind. What you do with it from there, who cares? You got them legally, didn't you? Yes. That'd be my suggestion. Find you a crew. Be legitimate contractors of some sort. And then do as I said. As opposed to wandering the desert hoping you'll find someone to rob them for you. Hmm. I think we'll go do that. Here. It ain't much, but it'll be the first little stepping stone, I suppose. When I get this off the ground and sunny stock is the number one currency in the world, I'll... I'll give you some. I'd appreciate that, Porter. Be my friend here. We're going ahead and ride off. I wish you the best of luck in your hunt for uh, stocks. Oh, I love stocks. <laughs> You'll be well now, Sonny. And practice that handshake. Do it alone. No, they, they they love money. So are we actually gonna gonna, gonna get real bonds? Hell no. <laughs> I was gonna say that sounds like a lot of work. Oh look, it's that brokey from yesterday. <clears throat> I need to speak to a lawman or woman. Oh, no. What? Ma'am, deputy. What do you owe knowing about, Miss? Uh, nothing. Who are you? Something got you on edge there? I'm just having a really strange day. Father says I have to burn this book. Yeah, I understand that you are trying to, you were trying to push yourself. What book is it? He has it. it it's a book about romance and it gets really steamy, but he says it's sinful. Well, I, I say you listen to your father. He's not my father. He is... A man of the cloth. Then he is all our fathers. Exactly. Then I suggest you listen to our father. Who's that? What? Well, that looks like a mighty big crew there coming to rob us all and throw us in his ditch. Maybe. I don't know who these people are. Please don't take my money. Please don't take. Kill her first. Kill her first. I'm innocent. We're stockbrokers. That's right. From New York. New York. New York. Big city. I bet you never even heard of that place because you can't afford an education. I can't afford an education. Don't lie to me. Lying is a sin. I can't. Nine, That's what nine, I thought. Ten. 
Lying is a lying is a sin. What kind of priest are you? What did you say? You heard me. No, I did not. They're arguing with the father. Does this man here preach? Oh my god. I'm an altar boy at Valentine Church. You better speak to me with some respect. I'm Father O'Connor of uh I'm a dealer out here, sir. And who ordained you, huh? Who ordained me the Lord himself. Oh, the boy. Now, I will not have you blaspheming out here, and I'm a dealer. Hey, zip de doo dah. Would you like to invest in some stock? Stock of what? Have you no faith? <laughs> Sir, I said stock of what? Have you no faith? No, I do not have faith in man. I have faith in the Lord. Have you no faith in money? No, I do not. Why? Do you have faith in money? Material gain? You care about these things? Yes. That's right. It's not how it appears. Life's all about money. I remember that voice. Is that how you do it on that time? Honestly. Mm. How much money to let that man go? I need a word. you with a goddamn trumpet. Who the hell are you? You wanna buy some stock? I'm gonna buy some stock. I don't make soup, sorry, I don't need stock. You idiot. No, you stupid brokey stock. New That's York okay. stock. The big city. Straight from New York. Straight from New York. Sunny, I want you New to York. Very, very well. Straight from New York. New York, the big city. The big the biggest city where all the rich folk are. And I'm rich and you're poor, so listen to me. Right. Because I'm right and you're wrong. Why would I want to if I if I'm poor, right? Why would I buy from you? Why would I want to make myself more poor? Because I can make you rich. Filthy, That's stinking right. rich. But I don't believe you, because you used to run around in your fucking socks. How would I buy this fancy suit from Chicago, second biggest city, if I was not rich? Riddle me that. Match. One of them's blue and the other part's black. Riddle me that. It's called Riddle fashion. That. Stripes are in. Well, your friends well, wearing wouldn't stripes. Know about fashion. Because he bought the cheaper suit. That's well, right, I'm like just starting to, too. I'm just starting to not be, see I used to be a brokey just like you, and then I bought some stocks from the big city. No. Yes. No. Would you like to go on a date with me? I would rather burn in a pit. How much money? <laughs> How much money to what? To let this man out of prison. None. Are you trying to bribe me? Yes. That's a crime, Sonny. Yes, I know. But money talks, and I got money. That's right. Money talks. No. Buy some stock. I bought this sheriff station. Show me the rip. Me and my brother here are looking to get some legally acquired bank bonds. Could you help us out? Do I look like a banker to you? No, but you work for the government. But I don't work for a bank, Sonny. But you work for the government who works for but banks. I don't work for the bank. The bank pays me. Bank puts the money in my pocket. 
And then you give no. that money to Sunny Falls for stock. That's right. No, how much is your stock? How much is your stock? However much you're willing to invest, I offer you triple your profits. 15 cents. I don't deal in cents. Ten dollars will do. Mm, That's right. Iris and that one dollar. I only deal in double digits. How many decimal places? Two. One, two, three. One hundred and twenty-three dollars. That's right. I'm not partaking in your silly games. Okay, goodbye. See ya. See you later. Toodaloo. Opportunity Run away. Scamper off, little broke rat. Little broke rat. You are a rodent. Bow before the rich. Bow before me. That's right. Make a bow. All is sunny in a rich man's world. Sunny, sunny, sunny. Money, money, money. In a rich man's world. Sunny, sunny, sunny. He's got so much money, money, money. Sing it with me now. That's right. Sunny, sunny, sunny. Stay on beat. Sunny, sunny, sunny. Money, money, money. In a rich man's world. Sunny, please. Please pay me. I will give you $10 if you get off the fucking porch. And a bank bond. I don't have bank bonds, Sunny. $10 will do. But then you have to give me 30 yeah. Yes, in three to six business days. That's right, three to six business days. Sing it with me now. Yeah, sunny, sunny, sunny. Sunny. Money. money, money, money. Hit the punchline, come on. Oh my god. In a rich man's world. Sunny Falls is an armadillo now. Trying to make Would you like to buy some stock? Come get your stock, it's selling quick. Who wants to be the first owner of Sunny Stock in this new town of Armadillo? That's right, the hardest selling stock. What is stock? What what are you bloody selling? Stocks. It's the future. That's right. However much you want to invest in three to six business days, you'll triple that. And you'll be rich. I own seven wagons. How many wagons do you own? Well, a, a, a stock of what exactly? What color's your wagon? Big and metal. Yeah. Good. What, do you, what do you have in stock? Stocks. Only stocks are in stock. What? What Which company one? are the stocks for? The best one. Sunny Stock. Sunny Stock? Sunny and Co. Proprietary Limited. Based out of Chicago, we own two gold farms and a lima bean factory. That's right. Lima bean. Get your hands off me, filthy peasant. <laughs> Didn't I hear you in Blackwater the other night? Begging some folks for money or something? You must got be confused with the other orphans. No, that's what this fella does. No. Oh, you you're know, so plentiful you, and you your know, finances, you're begging for money on the streets. You know, this fella pretending to be uh, disabled from the waist down to get money. I don't have a clue what you're talking about. I do. You bit my ankle, you little asshole. I was suffering from very deadly no nope. disease nope. after I was shot I was shot in the spine fucking 
ankle biter. Poor person. Uh, you should go and sell those uh, stocks to James Kelly. You'll love them. Come here. Come here. You. Zip. Come, come, come. If I don't come back, kill his friend. Nope, sit there with them. Sit there with them. You rob banks, right? Yes. I need bonds. A lot of them. That's what you're trying to sell? Stocks. And bonds? No, stocks. And no one bonds. will know they're bonds. Stocks. Oh, I see. I see. How much are you going to buy them off me for? What's the going rate? 30 a bond. 30's just fine. Alright, how many you want? How many you got? Uh, right now I think we have 120. Or 125. I will buy... Hmm... 10. Alright. Uh, uh, you gonna be around tomorrow? Yes, but I'd like them now. We don't have them now. Hello. Ah, oh, jeez. Here's what you do. You get a piece of paper. Like you give them a pickup time to pick up the bond. Say, you can't be walking around this suit. Carrying the bonds, you'll get robbed. Let them know this is a dangerous area. Tell everyone this is a dangerous area and you'd be stupid. A stupid businessman to walk around with that much bond or stocks, excuse me, on you. So you give them a slip, you sell the bond, stocks, for more than what we would sell you the Look, bond. I'm buying bonds off you. I'm not buying a bloody lecture. I know what I'm doing. Okay, we'll hand them the fucking slip and tell them to come pick it up tomorrow. Sure. Okay. Is that all? Yes. There's the sunny I know. Yes. No. Where's Bolton? We're gonna be rich. That's right. Yeah, you're gonna be rich. I already am rich. Taking everyone else's money. I was talking to everybody else, or your or you poor people. Look at your shirt. You When's the last time you Which took a damn you bath, got? you stinky poor peasant? <laughs> uh, this morning, actually. I don't believe you. He said my ass was gonna be grass. William War. Ah, <laughs> oh, You smell that? That's right. Smells yeah, like lavender. Like Everybody knows that lavender is what poor people smell like. Lemon fragrance is in. Yeah, it could be under Willie. Hey, we got lemons too. Straight from Guama. I guess you use whatever soap. Would you like to buy some stock in lemon? In lemon? We got lemon stocks. Yeah, so we got a lemon a company? I'll give you one call. We're going to establish a company in Guama for the trade of lemons. So the company's not even been built yet, but you're selling stock for a company that doesn't exist? Yes. Exclusivity. How much money you got in your pocket right now, brother? I'll tell you if you're richer than me. Thousand dollars and nineteen. Thousand and nineteen dollars. Poor person. How much she got? Twenty-five hundred. Okay, but how many carriages you own? You're right. Uh, just the I one. Gave you the yeah, Only one. Get a load of this guy. He only owns one carriage. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, no. What colors? Hey. What colors Wheels. your carriage? Wheels. Shut the fuck up, Sonny. <laughs> You two come with me right now. What? It's armored. Indy. Rowan. I think he's getting out right now.
Take that, take that package. We need, we need to carry our stocks. Get off the porch. You leave the package alone. You know the deal. What's in your package? Stop trying to touch my package. Walter, my package is bigger than package? yours. Cooper's package. Listen. Okay. If my package is smaller than oh, yours, why well. you covered it so much? All right. Thank you, Walter. You. What color is your wagon? Have a good Mary. one, Hi. How are you doing, Mary? Are you able to add a recipe pills? Oh. Yeah, oh I goodness. will sort it all. I will sort it Get all. Out. I, I thought you were gonna wither away. Um, on that though, who, whoever so wrote that report sweet. needs needs a throttle. Mm. Sorry. No, it's no worries. God, how much fair bread have you been feeding him? Hi. But either of you want to, you know, uh, Hello? invest in some stock. No. Now don't you be mean I can make you rich. It is, yes. Oh. Okay, I'll go sort that. Oh. It's Bulge, actually. It's, bul it's Bulge. Yeah, Bulge. Bulge. You know no, my orphan brother. If I didn't know any better, I would leave before the bullets start flying. I got the package. Sure, Get the I fuck out of here. Out. There's one lesson I need to teach you, is that violence oh, that? brings money. We stay in this general vicinity. When a violent act o occurs, we will be rich. Well, then let them back. Oh, okay, I'm gonna trust you on this one. Oh my god. Hey, gentlemen. Don't mind us. We're just spectating. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. What uh, spectate, I'm gonna go her? finish paperwork. You watch if, your tone, mister. If you were Walter. You watch your tone. You're not gonna call my fiance the harlot of the West. Or you're gonna be the corpse in the West. Them's his fighting words. Oh I'm not, God. sir, but I will not. Stand any disrespect towards my fiance. Hold your fence. Well, yes. Yes, I do. Yeah, come on up. Well, probably anyone if you insulted their fiance. Well, God damn it. All right. God damn it. All right, I am the Valentine friend. No, and I'm sick of being confused. I am the Valentine friend. Friend, the Valentine friend. No, 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 no. We gotta find this Walter because we can give him that five thousand dollars. Well, I wish I could hang on to it for him. You want me to hang on to it? No, I don't know, but I can hang on to it. All right, I'm Walter. I, I'm Walter. You got me. Now, where's my $5,000? Well, I'm not Walter. How yeah, much donation to RDM? Uh, 20 gifted subs. I, I'm not Walter. I just really need to, I just got fined a thousand dollars for something I didn't do. What is your problem? What is your problem? What the hell is wrong with you? You strangled him, you took right. my brother and you tried to convince him to eat me. Who the hell is this? These are the sunnies. What the hell do they want? Oh God, they look the same. Do you want to buy some stocks? stock? <laughs> Uh, no, I'm no, not. not wait, I can wait, make yeah, you yeah, rich. Stop. That five thousand dollars that he offered you ain't nothing. You know how many carriages I own? Too wait, many. Wait. All right, well, you, let me talk to this guy and then and then I'll listen. Maybe we'll stay here patiently. Right. I do need to get rich. I do need money. All right, Don't how about you talk us. to them first? You get rich and then you come find me. No, right. this is I gonna take a rich. while. Right. You finish this. Just don't hurt him. No, no, no. You finish. You finish. I have. No, no, no. I insist. I insist. Too late. Well, well God damn it! Someone talk to me. Please, please keep Gerg, uh, you know, entertained with your your stocks. The right? Who the hell is Gerg? That's his name. That's his name. 
Right, Gerg. Gerg. How many aliases do you have? Sir, I am from Earth. No shit, we all are. All right. The fuck I'm not that? from Earth. I'm from New York, the big city. That's yeah, right, the big city. Sunny, sunny, sunny. Okay, you sing the... I'd love to hear. Right. I, I need to get rich. They just find me a thousand dollars. She's, I think, having a, a breakdown. Mary, oh. Mary, come here. These fine, these fine folk are gonna get Mary, us rich. Are you, are you in there? Mary? Mary, what's your husband's name? Hi. Get away from Mary. What? Stop crowding her like that. I don't like that. Don't crowd around her like that. You can harass this man's wife after I'm done with him. You Please refrain. That's right, he's a valued client. I don't, Mary, they're talking nonsense. Absolutely not. This is Jorge. Uh, no, Father, they are talking nonsense. I've never met these men in my life. You promise? I promise. I couldn't lie. You pinky swear? I pinky swear. Pinky. Okay. She ain't gonna turn up dead. I tell you what, this town sure is bustling. That's right. A lot of money to be made. That's right. You know, Moses, everyone, really. All right, thank you. Now, how? Wednesday? Wednesday? We're getting married after the circus on Wednesday? Sure. All right, When's sure. the circus? We could have a circus themed wedding. Yeah, all right. Yeah, that sounds great. Oh, Frog's gonna love this. Oh. Because of the Don't account of the sin, right? Yeah, John. Oh. But he never plays. All right. No, no. Frog, you know, he just. My oh, mouse doing. He, he, Michael ain't been right ever since. Uh, Michael's been through a lot. That much. We are gonna rebuild this town with you. First step in there. Good right. job. Very well then I will take my leave. Oh my god. Oh remember hey. I paid good money for that package. He needs a what? Hey, don't do that. Right. We bought these damn okay. packages. So this is my package. I can do that. I can do that. No problem. You're just jealous yeah, of my package. I'm probably gonna go rest up. All right. You owe me fifty bucks. You just tarnished my Chicago suit. Goodbye, Mary. Love Goodbye. you. I love you too. Material. I'm so excited. You ruined the damn linen. I'm excited too, Mary. Off, I paid six hundred bucks for this suit. Cause I got money to spend. That's right. There she goes, the woman of my dreams. And you don't, because you got no stock. Big uh, money. Let me hear it. I don't, because I put it all on black. I bet you did. I bet you gambled all your money away, you damn degenerate, you poor That's peasant. Right, you're a brokey. Brokey. That's right. It's a little slang he picked up in New York. I don't know where he got it from. Big city. Wow. New York City? That's right. The big city. I hear they got buildings up there that are so high they're tickling God's ball sack. And they got people in those buildings that do absolutely nothing. And they're rich. 
Wow, I'd love to do that. That's right. We could tell you all about it. All right. Yeah, sure. We'll... Where are we going? Uh, but is there no place to sit down in this... Sh sh the gallows. Mm -hmm. God, I hate the desert. We go to the saloon? That's right. Yes. I'll just keep following you. Yes. Guys. Okay, all right, here. It's down this way. So how's your day been? Well, confusing. Keep going to jail. Some guy's running around looking like me on a crime spree, I guess. When you get enough money, it's impossible to go to jail. That's right. Really? Well, I'm... Oh, sorry. There's a there's rock in my boot. Nice pants. I really, I need, I, thank you. I really need money then. Judging by the f your frame, I'd say you got a fair amount of money. Well, thank you. I mean, I, I had. Some You're very well fed. That's true. I've never skipped a meal. Be good. I can tell. Yes, sir. I've never skipped a meal. Yes, sir. A lot of power in a man's belly. That's that's right. And finally, someone that understands. That's right. All right. Take a seat. Over here. Oh, sorry. Oh, we were gonna sit down. Oh, okay. That's right. This is the, the VIP bench. Right, on. all right. Uh, hmm. Very important package. Uh, can I sit over right. here, maybe? No. Okay, well. Let me just. Uh... Take a seat. I. I will not. I insist. <laughs> nope, I, I won't. This is Mary's couch. I ain't gonna sit here without her. Ah. Tick tock. What the? So what's your name there? Jorge Balje. I was just, I just got engaged today. What were those, uh, disgusting scum? They weren't calling you Jorge. Yeah, everyone keeps calling me this Walter fella. Not me. Hmm. Strange. It is it is very strange. Maybe if they could afford a proper education, they wouldn't be getting all confuddled. You, you, you're, pro you, you're right, right about that? You're probably right about that. That's right. Well, it's your lucky day. All right. Old Jay. Or oh, hey. That's yes, sir. right. You strike me as a man down on his luck. Yeah, I'm about $3,000 in down. mistaken identity debt. With not enough money to care for his loving wife. No, that's... His extremely pretty wife. Yeah. I mean, that, yeah, yes, that that's true, but a, a little hurtful, but, but true. His soft-spoken... Petite wife. Yeah, that's... That's, that's all, right. That's all... Ways to describe her. I bet she wishes her husband had some money. Right. Probably. It probably. I bet she's be. looking for a new up, new alternative. No, I don't think that's the case. I bet. 
That's well, right, already looking. Well, I don't know. I, don't I bet she guess. saw two young gentlemen in fancy suits okay. walk in the what, town. What are y'all gonna help me? With or? a whole lot of money. Two briefcases right. stacked with stock. Okay. Two young entrepreneurs. Right. Exuding, right. exuding with confidence. Are y'all just gonna help me or make me feel bad? They go hand in hand. You can't, I can't help you if you don't help yourself. And to help yourself, you need to be drowning in pity and sorrow. And your wife may need to leave you in order for you to turn your life around. Well, your I don't want to stop. leave you. Just like me and my orphan brother here. Okay. We had to live on the streets of New York and then St. Denis and Van Horn. My parents had to be abducted by the law and murdered for me to discover my new passion Surely there's of money. Way. Surely there's another way. Your life has to be filled with despair to realize your true potential. There's and you need no to you need to own at least ten carriages to be successful. All right, okay, well how what how do I get into this stock thing? Because it sounds kinda nice. Just a short, short, short lesson. A hundred bucks and I'll teach you. Sign That's up to right. my course. The low price of one hundred dollars. All right, what's what is it exactly? Can you tell me more? Or? The art of the scam. <laughs> That's right. Is is this the scam or? No. Well, what it... This is a once in a lifetime opportunity All right. to be taught by the greatest, reason? richest, you, you your... most right. handsome, you... successful scammer in the All crossing. Right. All right, take my money. Yeah, I, I don't want my wife to leave me here. I have a collection of golden guns and 10 wow. carriages. Wow. How many golden guns? I pretended to be a cripple for two weeks. And you should have seen them lining up. Help the orphan boy. Help poor little Sonny. I remember when you wrote in town, I could hear from jail cell. Someone said, is that the guy that was pretending to be crippled? That's me. All right. Well. But it's too late. They figured it out. Too late. They already gave me their money. And now okay. I'm rich. All right. Well, I'll. When, when do when when do these lessons start? Right now. Well, I'm very exhausted. It, it can these lessons start next week? Is that don't possible? care. Success don't care. does not sleep. Well, you want your wife to leave you? No, I don't want her to leave me. Look, I'll gladly do do. I mean, this sounds great, but I can this can we re, can we schedule for next week? Is that possible? Next week, right? A whole week. Thursday, maybe. You get approached by two men in suits, made in Chicago, from New York, promising you that you're gonna be rich, and you say, "Can we wait a week?" Ah, uh, yeah, I'm tired. I'm sleepy. I've been through a lot today. Where are you gonna be for a whole week? I've gotta bathe. I suppose it does take a long time to wash a body of that magnitude. It's in there deep too. He's got a point. He does have a point. Hmm. Hmm. Look, I, I can give you my post and you know, you just get a hold of me. You know, I bathe on Mondays and Tuesdays. I'm in there bathing. I'm a rare, rare sighting. Well, that's not instilling a lot of confidence. No, because I don't use telegrams. Oh, I see. You either see me or you don't. All right, well, I mean, surely we can schedule something. Perhaps. Dot, dot, dot.
A whole week. Well, yeah, well, not a, a whole week. week. A whole week. I mean, a few days. Right? You're gonna be missing a lot of money. I'm, I'm, ve I'm very, very. A tired. lot of good lessons. A whole lot. Oh, how about tomorrow? No, ba ba bathing tomorrow. Well, I guess I will be around every day around this time. All right. Well, do, if if you want, you could just take my telegram and. What's your telegram? All right, it's DG doing good 939. Did you get that? Uh, doing good 939. I meant, did you write it down? Is, is, is it doing good 939? Is that it? That's it. I'll remember it. All right. All right, fellas. We'll talk. Hey, to you. Are you going to pay now? Or are you going to pay later? I can pay later. Can you? Y yes, I can. I forgot you made the rules. Well, you asked me. I I'll pay later. You hear that? He makes the rules. You asked me. You gotta pay now. I gotta pay right now? That's right. Can I do half, maybe? Perhaps. Maybe. I'll try, I'll try to give you half and see what happens, I guess. Half is acceptable. There, there you go. I'll see you around. All right. Well, I hope so. I just gave you fifty dollars, Mister, Mister Jorge. Can, can you say your telegram one more time? Yep, it's doing good. DG nine three nine. Next time I see you, we're taking you to the big city. Wow. We're gonna you see if there's any tailors that can fit a coat around that big belly of yours. New York That's City. That's right. The big city. All right. I'm excited. All right. I'll see you boys next week sometime. And teach you how the way of the stock. That's right. The way of the stock. Is, is it the stock or the scam? You got a lot to learn. That's all right. Okay. Right. All right. All right, see you boys. Thanks for the opportunity. That's right. Keep an eye on your telegram. All right, I will. Bye. Once in a lifetime. Don't let it slip. All right. Okay, goodbye. I think I just found a new method. That's right. Damn the shaders, dude. Holy shit. So red. By the way, I totally stole the deputy's package. I know. I don't even know what's in here. You might as well check. Probably another damn rope. Potato soup and coffee. <laughs> poopy, poop, 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 poop. Thanks for the follow, brother. Don't you come over here. You two stay away. Hey, fellas. I think I yeah, let's fuck right here. off right now. 
Look, there's an Avistra thing over here near the telegram station. Oh, there he goes. He walked in and he, I, he took his wallet for a second and it was huge. He must have walked around the other side of the building where we can still eavesdrop from. Maybe we should go inside. Thing. Sandwich stronger than you. They're talking about sandwiches. They must be hungry. Remember it was the weak that's still standing by the stronger and the dirt. <laughs> you look at all those deputies standing around you. Standing in front of you. Created them. He trained them. He taught them everything he knows. He lives on with them, with the badge. One of those badges that buries you in the ground. He's not dead, but you will be. At least my wife can hug me. <laughs> His can't. <laughs> oh my god, bro. Zip's a menace. Or yours? He'll join me. What a great husband you are. Put her in the ground with you. Maybe. But at least she won't be weeping over my fucking grave because of a mistake I made. You think this is what poor people get up to? Sam's good for something. Probably. He's not what a boring now. life. Yeah, he is. He stands with every one of us here. They probably have so many problems because they're all so broke. You're telling me... Those deputies over there. Sam is in them. Yeah. My fist is about to be in your fucking you face. You said that to me again. Hey, Zip. What I was that, Weller? I to ask you. You heard me? Sit on the sidelines, little boy. Little boy. <laughs> what about the friends you lost along the way, Zip, huh? Friends who were murdered by your own friends. You want to talk about weak and strong? What was the no, name I'm of the fellow who was shot and killed, standing. huh? With a dead body, easily replaced like nothing in the wind. And you're right, winners does live in all of us, every single one of us. He taught us something we learned from, and then we stand true to it. We don't chase after it. We don't hold him in a fucking pedestal like you do so many others. Here's your strong man. I'd rather have Weller by my side than you any day, Zip. Yeah, no shit. I've got a bomb in this packet. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> the only thing he's gonna carry on to every one of you is the weakness that he died for. Because you guys are getting so fucking emotional. Over some piece of shit that fucking died. Some nothing. Some name that won't be mentioned right in now, a week Zip? from now. What is it you want, Zip? Nothing. Why are you still standing in front of me? To remind you. That's what we're gonna do if someone tries to rob us. Hey, I got dynamite in this package. It's gonna blow. For how long? As long as I can bloody stand. I'll stand. And I'll save your ass too. again and again. I don't know what this guy thinks he's doing by standing in the window. He passed him. I'm 
still happy I didn't ruin the gun. So happy that Ollie will get that gun back. Tell me this. Is it you that telegrammed him? Pretending to be a dead man. How'd that make you feel, Jim? Have to pretend to be something that you could never be. A sick, twisted prick you really are. To do something like that. No, probably about it, Jim. I'll be there. That means this whole little hand the badge over was at the show. Yeah. I wanted to show you what it means and how much it does protect your fucking ass. It doesn't protect anything. <laughs> sure it doesn't. Then do something, Danny. You don't have the badge. Show me. Show me how well I'm protected. Because I'm not protected because of the badge on your chest. I'm protected because you're fucking weak. You can believe that all you want, Skip. Then do something. The badge is off, Danny. Do something. You want to. <laughs> it's eating at you, isn't it? <laughs> it's eating at you. I saw your hand quiver over your gun. <laughs> you were scared. Was I? Yeah, you were. Everyone here saw it, Chip. I was just getting ready. Mm. The badge protects you. Is it? It does. And it will it's continue not. to protect you. It's not. It's a weakness are, that you guys have that you can't go past your fucking moral code. You can't do what you think is right. If I had fucking Sam right here with my hand around his fucking neck and a gun to his head, he would have to follow protocols. But even if he didn't have that badge, he would have still done the right fucking thing, Danny. That's what makes you weak. Makes me strong, Jip. I... I do have a question, though, Zip. Yeah, what is it? It was your gun that he wronged you with. Why do you need Jack? I didn't. You didn't need Jack? I didn't. No, I didn't ask anyone to do that. anything. Oh, okay. I read the report. Did you get a statement from the police <laughs> over there? I'll let you tell me what happened. I'd tell you his last words if you'd like. I'm the only one. That knows it. Something about Tilly. <laughs> he turned around. I did. I don't think it's Danny, is it? Isn't Danny dead? Bye, Bolton. Have a good one. Hey, ours, I really want to punch these fucks in the face. Please. Does anyone want to buy some stock? Jesus Christ. Sonny, read the room.
I wonder how much a hotel room is. So sleepy, thanks for the follow, brother. How you doing, Badger? 133 bucks. I think I'm ready for bed. Yeah, me too. Well, I'll see you tomorrow. I'll see you tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> it, yeah. Yeah, that'll be good. Oh, dude. I don't know why it's been so fucking hot lately. It's fucking winter, man. It's 22 degrees in winter. I mean, that ain't hot, but it's like, it's hot in my room for some reason. People still play Fortnite. Why is this on my recommended? What the fuck is this shit? Oh, I'm not logged in, that's why. Holy shit. I'm not logged in, that's why. Shut up. Um, let's raid. You know what? We'll raid, bud. Oh, brother, it is cooking. Appreciate you hanging out, Joy, everybody else. Oila, appreciate you hanging out, Joy, everybody else. Can this shit stop playing? Can't wait to get them bonds. Yeah, it's gonna be real nice. Cool, cool. Joy, Tyler. Finn boy, Lizard. Chad. Carol, everybody. Hanging out. I'll see everybody tomorrow. Damn, who? 1.5k. Damn. Hoopy boy. The hoopster. I put in my like third partner application, bro. If I don't get it, I'm gonna fucking, I'm gonna fucking kill Twitch. In it, you gotta run me through these shaders, brother. You, I think I got the diff. I think I got a different one, man. I don't have the same fucking options you have. Did you install the real blue one or, or the other one? Come over from Penta, Jorge. <laughs> have a good one, dude. I'm gl I'm glad. Uh, Panther came back over here, man. Zip. 